No, I will not be in the office today. Cancel all appointments till tomorrow. Thank you. Because I know who you are. My bedroom must go down. I was about honoring your invitation when Mr. Hush offered me a special wine. Oh, 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 so how did you go with him? Guess what? Mr. Hush is interested in the business. Mm. Wonderful deal. Mm. But I thought you said you're done with him. I mean, concerning the deal. No, he called me. So I went to his office. To my greatest surprise, he now made his intentions known. He is fully interested in the deal. Wow, wow. But why they call me up and down now? What's happening? Hey, see, in as much as I am happy for what you just said, but right now, I want you to be careful. You know, Germans, you know, Germans and their ways, you know. I thought you said you are not in the mood of discussing business. Yes, yes, but you just... <laughs> forget the details, forget the details. My wife left for Abuja today. Her sister delivered a set of twins. Wow. Yeah, all efforts to make this woman fly proved abortive. She refused to fly. Why? Yes, you know, she's still struggling with this, uh, this phobia. You know, she lost her classmate in that ill-fated flight. Oh. Uh, ever since, she has this strong phobia. So she for still flight. has phobia for flash. Strong one. Strong one. Strong one. Okay. But like they say, Afronke, Abuna Afronke, I mean. So what's the deal? You have a deal already. So it's time to what? Unwind. Oh. Just go somewhere. Just party. I <laughs> yeah. won't mind. I won't want like. Okay, yeah. now I get it. Okay. Married man won't have fun. <laughs> Married man wants to enjoy. Daddy, okay. Daddy said married men don't have fun. Hmm? Let's have fun. So because your wife is out of town, you don't have fun. No, 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 don't even go there. You you came with the good news. Okay. So I wanted to crown it up with Angwale. It's not a bad idea. Though. So what do you have in mind? Uh, uh, Kelvin told me of one special place in town where they have girls in different shapes and sizes. We know they sleep now. I know they are. I said we know they sleep. Another place. Danny. Bolas. Hey! Bolas. Danny, you, you are so unrighteous. When will you change? Kevin told me that club is barely two months old. I know they sleep now. I know the club. But you see, if you reach there, mm. you see them in all sizes. Sleep, a day or a bus. A day. Whatever you want. You get there. So, what are we waiting for? I'm ready to ball. 10 o'clock. <laughs> I mean, before you change mine, which car are we using? Mine, yours, or both? Can be asking which car? Any of the cars can go now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Call me by 10. Make I fix one or two. One now. Are we there? When you go. It's all right. I'll be waiting.
Oh. Oh, shit, I'm naked. Shall we pray? You come run, see the pray. Who does that? How can you be praying before sex? Please, you don't have to be naughty. Eh? I know what I'm here for, so I'm ready for the video. Why you go pray now? You know whether I be pagan. Why you go pray for here? You don't pray for your house. It's wrong now, it just turned me off. How can you be praying before sex? I don't pray to you, I pray to God. So how do you have any problem with that? You come once, you they pray. How? Now turn off now. Prayer has nothing to do with sex. Please, I'm ready and I know what I'm here for. So please come and lie down. Let's start it. Why you go pray for here? I pray. Sleep, I don't do it. It's all like a chuku. Wakey, wakey. Come on. It's past 5 a.m. already. Are you not leaving? This one, you're still sleeping. I told you I was going to win you. Then, you know, then, uh, uh, look at your stretch. <laughs> yeah. I left you alone, though. I was running away, lazy ass. Good Me? morning. Mm -hmm. Me, lazy ass. Yes. Look at you. Do you know when I got dressed? You're still in bed. Mm -hmm. Lazy man. <laughs> That's lazy. I was running kitty kitty kata kata up and down. I'm not even doing it. Who woke up first? I just woke up first. I'm a man. What is good in the book? What are you? A praying or? Who does that? I show what they pray. Last night you, you started praying, which turned me off. This early morning again, you are carrying chaplet. Listen, you can call it whatever you want to call it. I greeted you good morning and I prayed to my God. There is nothing good about this morning because you cannot deceive me with your church girl pretense. If you like, pray from now till next year. You cannot deceive me. You want me to see you as a church girl so that you can steal whatever you want and run away and I won't suspect you, right? You cannot fool me. Then let me even check. I said it. Where is my wallet? Where is my jean? Where is my necklace? Where's my watch? Enough of you calling me a thief. You've been calling me names since last night. For re Since last night. Enough of the name calling, please. Praying your, more. Where is my stuff? Your clothes and your shoes are there. That is where they are. When I woke up in the morning to eat myself, your expensive watch almost, almost knocked me down. Oh yeah, very expensive, of course, and someone would have stolen it. I have trust issues. Just pray that none of my stuff is missing. Because I will, I will strangle you to death here. Pray, pray it all. Thank you, stars.
Everything is intact. Sorry I was careless with words. I'm used to it. Please. My time has expired. See, 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 I, I don't send women. As you see me, so I know send women. I'm just trying to be nice here. So take it easy. You don't have to be nice. I know what I'm here for. My time is expired. So please give me my money. No send to my grandmama. So take it easy. We are rid of 15,000. Take. That's 20,000. Get out of my room. Praying her. And I never see her show where they pray before. I'm not school. interested in your 20,000 Naira. All I'm interested in is the money that we both agreed on. Please take back your money. One, two, three, four, five. This is my money. Take my money. Are you pretending to be a good I girl or are you, are you a good girl normally? Wait, are you a good girl? I be just a forward I don't know. Your money, please. Huh? Your money. Just, just take your money. Just take your money now, please. Thanks for this. Daniel. Bro. Dan, what's the meaning of this? I mean, what's she still doing here? And you? Let me borrow your word. I thought you should have been done edging my brother. Your partner left and I go. Please, if I come back and meet you here, it will take a surgery to restore your face. Bro, calm down. You must not dramatize to pass your message. Is this necessary? Well, Danny, by the time I come back, you will know if it is necessary or not. You, leave. Should be done by now. Leave! You know what I owe her. Come down now. My brother can go. Excuse me. Brother, you relax. I relax now. I got this. Well, calm down. No see. problem. I, I'm done here. You two calm down. You two the verse. Huh? He's a married man. And no responsible man will like his neighbors to see his girls coming out of, out of his compound at this time of the day. So calm down. He's protecting his interest as a married man. Thank you. I'm done with you. So please, let me go. This is your money. Come on. Ah. This is my card. Call me when you have family problem. <laughs> and, and you think it's easy to bring me back here? Just is yours. Save job. Wow. Okay, let's see that. Mm. you get this water from? Do not lie to me, oh, because if you do, I'm mad I will strike you to death. Now, bam. Mama, I, I got it from your, from your place. But the gate was open, oh. The gate was open. I was calling, calling, calling. Nobody was answering. So I, I just decided to enter and, and, and fetch water. But just this one, so Just this one. Shalom. In my, my gate break and enter. No, it is open. You are a thief. Have I not announced to the whole villagers that I do not want them to be coming to my house to get water? Yes. Uh -huh. Yes, you have announced. The thing is that the stream is very far and I've been suffering. Hey. So I say, let me just go to the nearest. Far for what? You have been suffering. Yes, and your mother suffered so much till your father killed her no. from fetching the water. Has she not been fetching water from that stream before you were born? Yes, but it's very far. It's very far. Hey, mama! Hey, 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 Do not 
Don't break and enter in my house. Else I will report you to the police. On your remorse. and the people will come and pack my property. Eh? I don't know why my children are wasting money paying you. Why are they paying you salary? What are you working for? I don't understand where all this one is coming from, man. I was just trying to finish the soup by cooking. Shut up! Before. Shut up! You were here, and you didn't know when you go my crept into this compound and fetch water. Eh? When? Eh, in a job, eh, when? But to God who made me, nobody came here. I did here since morning. I'm watching everywhere, standing, walking up and down for this compound. Nobody came here. To God who made me pack your things because you are different. Hey. You are so incompetent. To God who made you, you are so incompetent. You see this security? Walk. You see this gentleman walk? You failed on it. So pack your things because I will make my children to as in sack you. It is a must. Come on, just, just, just good forever. Then how, how, how do you get man and the end? security man? You are not guiding anything. If you show Koloko Bango, you show. Ako Wawosa. Ay! Monaga Mambi Ozo! Nkanye Bile Azugo! Ay! If I find any of my rapper, any of my jewelry that I bought from the UK, I will sew them with you. Walk out, walk back, back, back. Walk on on back. Bum bum, titi, bum bum. Shock on the bank will show. Nah, like play, like play. This thing don't turn to another thing. First, pack your bag. I don't agree. I go feed pack up. Which one be bum bum, titi, bum bum? Madam, madam, I go say bum bum, titi, bum bum, bum bum, titi, bum bum. It don't turn to another thing, no. Ya kan mafuru wanye chenji kapa give me troubles every day back to back yo Ya kan mafuru wanye chenji kapa give me troubles every day back to back mama put you up in the chair I want to see mama 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 bina right now come on did you fetch water in this compound today because she came back and she was shouting Shouting everywhere. Did you fetch me? Come on, guys, come on for me. Immediately. Come on. Come on. What, what, what kind of woman is this? Oh, yeah, Diva. So, you came to my compound to raise boys. If you want to raise your voice, go to your own compound. Eh? What? I'm not and you watch Eba. If you want to raise your voice, you go back to your house and do that. Eh? Yes, in Akulum rent. Are you paying what any bills did you here? Do with the girl on my daughter came to fetch water with you. That is the reason why I am here. Ibewe, was that a question? Dear woman, I am only respecting you because of the boys you have for my late brother, your husband. If not, no deme. If not, in general. If not, what will happen? Otherwise, the other way it's I gave an instruction. I do not want people to be coming here to fetch water. Is that too big to keep? Eh? And you, you felt you are an itchier. You and your family can flaunt my orders. The next time you will come here to fetch water, I will not break. In fact, eh, what I will do to you? Mbagi paint. Ijendo, uh -huh. Ijendo, uh -huh. you must hear from me. 
I am hearing from you. I said you must hear from me. I said I am hearing from you again. What's your problem? What is your own problem? Get me again, Sobu. What can open this gate? Let them get out from my house. What's your problem? Go and buy gallons. Be ready, go to Innocent. Eh? All that plastic, original gallon. Okay, man, can have your They should use it to produce gallons for you because what I will break. Eh? Mkwonya gong 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 Now get out Ija let me tell you eh. We married you eh. We married you into this compound And there's nothing you can do to cause us headache Ija you take your time Oh you think Take it your was time When your brother was alive Eh Then one them walk here Ida got here Then one them walk here Come inside now No Come again I get up, Come again. Come, we're looking for a call. Yes. You want to go? Get out. No. Leave my compound. She moves out from me. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. One day you will open this gate for robbers. They will come and rob me. Eh? Okay, okay, you may puzzle. Okay, for me, you may puzzle. What okay, for? You will go. I've told you to pack your things. What are you doing? In fact, you see this. Come, 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 come. Get out. I want you to do it properly. I am locking this gate. You see this key? I'm in charge now. I'm over the security. Get out. Get out, Mr. Leather. I, I have the key. I will check it properly. 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 Check it Okonko, exactly what you had. Ijeno has turned to a tigress in this community. Hmm. In the women's meeting, even in the church. Does Ijen even go to church? Hey! She pushed my daughter's gallon of water and broke it. I just left her house and she was ramping. My late brother, her husband, dug that bohole because of these children, knowing fully well that the stream is so far from them. Yes. Immediately that man died, she locked up. Is Ingendu a human being? I'm asking. Was that her reason for returning from the city into this village? So that she can start dragging uh, boho and other small, small land? Sure. If she wants to start selling the water, she should say so. <laughs> Instead of using conny conny way to stop us from fetching water there. Eh? But what will happen is, we will go and see her. Yes, I will go with some of our clan's men. And we will talk to her and tell her that that boho does not belong to her. Hey. It belongs to our brother. Eh? So we will go and see her. But I think, uh, will it not be better we involve our children? Because they may not be part of this. They may not be aware. Um, I think we will do that. Yes, it will be fine. Yes. But let us talk to her first. Yes. Okay. Let's talk to her. My beautiful daughter. Uh, Let's go. Ugo Mwa. Don't worry, eh? You shall be well. After we have spoken with her, everything will be fine. Huh? Let's uh, go, my beautiful daughter. Yeah, Let's yeah, go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. 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 let us when I heard that, what came to my mind was that Ugoma is a very calm girl that does not look for trouble. She should have tried that with Amarachi. By now, is it that Amarachi is still in the police station or she has run away from here? Ikenna, I can't. She's a mother. And she has rights over her thing. Which rights? I am aware when that borehole was dug and we are going there to fetch water. 
her husband brought out two pumps outside. Yet, it's Ijendo that removed it. I wonder what somebody did to that woman. Eh? That's her part. Ugum. Mm -hmm. When I come into the house. Which house? To do what? Mm -hmm. So all the efforts I've been doing to make you my girlfriend, you're still playing hard to get. What's the problem? Huh. Nothing, no. There's no problem. Ikenna, Rosemary is pregnant for you. Do you also want to get me pregnant? No, are you not counting senses of guests that are pregnant for you? Is that what you are doing? Leave me alone, oh. Leave me alone. Go and marry Rosemary. Onyedi. Muabu ikenna wongo ogo. Got who pregnant? Ngwa negodim. Negodim. I did not. Even if she said I did, let us wait until the child is born. Then we can know who the father is. You know Rose now? She's a waka waka girl. Oputamuraku kompuraku. That lazy girl. Ha! Not someone like you that respects herself. Also hard working. <laughs> Ikenna. 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 How many times did I call you? Like I said before, we are friends. Let's just leave it at that. Rose is pregnant for you. Since Rose is good enough for you to get her pregnant, she should also be good enough for you to marry her. You see that child? It is yours. Go and marry her and leave me alone. Leave me alone, no! Oh. I'm going home. See, Ugoma, Ugoma, look at the way you called my name. Ikena. Ikena. See, you are dying for me. Oh. <laughs> Why did you say that? No, I've been lonely, if you ask me. I miss you and my daughter. I swear down. I am missing you so, so much. Don't tell me people are not planning to come back immediately. Huh? Don't even try it. Don't even try it. The house is lonely. No wife, no daughter, just all alone. After work, I come back, it's just me. Check out now. Eh? Ne. Eh, Biko? I am missing you and I'm missing my daughter. I love you so much. I love you. It's all good. It's all good. Eating. Ah. Can we go to I still eat. I do. I do. All right then. If she wakes up, uh, yeah, call me so that I'll speak with her. I've not heard a voice in a long while, and I want to hear that voice again. All right, sunshine. Bye bye. All right. Just take good care of yourself, and remember what I told you. When my daughter wakes up. Call me so that I'll speak with her. It's all right. Love you so much. Bye bye. Man, it's not easy. <laughs> uh. All right. We summoned you here as regards to what has been happening at the borehole. We, the Omona, are here to tell you that we are not happy at all. Oh. We are not happy with what is going on at that boho recently. The villagers are complaining. When you wanted to remove the pump, the outside pump, I personally advised you to let it be the way it was. But you refused. You went ahead and removed it. Now you are the one complaining about people trooping into the compound to fetch water. Oh. Are you not the one that caused it? Okonkwo. With all due respect, mind how you talk about that borehole. Oh. It doesn't belong to the entire village. The borehole in question belongs to my late husband. Give it some credit. Um, um, Ijendu, why, why, but who? Need we remind you that we are elders of this village? Elders? Yes! We are not children that you can flog. Uh -uh. 
Mark is a wanyoku. Know how you talk to us. Yes. See, this borehole in question was what Chief Ikechuku Elendo. Agutaburi they are wang. No, Zara. Nuku Maruka Nukualo. Hey! He gave to us. You can't lay claim of it. Mba. You can't. Can you imagine? A man who was so blessed. Mm. So blessed that he wanted his blessings to extend to his clansmen. Mm. Um. And you want to hinder it from us. You want? Mm. No, the gods are watching you. The gods have their eyes on you. The gods are watching me. Agotabuli be a one. My husband was never a traditionalist. He was a Christian. So the God I serve is watching you. He is seriously watching you to lay claims of what does not belong to you. <laughs> Were you the engineer that dug the borehole? Eh? Or a member of the board of directors in my late husband's company? Which one are you, Ikede? Have you gone to the city before? Huh? Village in Wogan. Village in Tona. Village. Village in Wogan. Have you ever traveled? Where have you gone to? Huh? Isi ama unkwa. Jog boko, siok boko. Bato buofia. And you have the guts to tell me nonsense. Do you know what it takes to dig borehole? Again. Your husband was our brother. Oh, was? He personally informed us before he dug that borehole that his intention was to make us happy and to be stress free. Yes. Really? yes. In getting water from this village. Well, I wasn't there when he told you. Instead of you telling us to contribute money to pay the bills, or better still, contribute money to buy fuel whenever mm -hmm. there's no light, instead you went ahead and told us to stop fetching water from that borehole. Your children have asked us to continue fetching water from that borehole. Are you now telling us they supported you on this one? Oh. Answer me! Answer, Chukun. My husband, late husband, told you and your children and wives to fetch water. That was in the past. Eh? And my Old Testament and New Testament. I know you don't read Bible. Now tell me. All of a sudden you are asking a woman who has traveled far and near to all the African countries and beyond. Who has lived in the city all her life. Who has done businesses with her husband. Nonsense question. You don't do that with me. Daniel and Obina are my children. They should do what I want or ask me what I want, not the other way around. Now listen, I want all of you to take this to your wives and children, not to come and fetch water anymore. Tell them I said so to your faces. God didn't want to see someone me. Hey! Shokoboko Bank on shows. Hey! 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 She just walked out on us without respect. Huh? Hey. Can you imagine? Hmm. Did you hear what that woman was blabbing? Hmm. Has she any conscience at all? She doesn't have. Because anyone who has blood in his or her veins wouldn't behave the way she behaves. Uh, 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 Look at what she's saying. She has gone to this, she has gone to that. Yet, she's behaving like a bush woman. Like a bush woman. She just she is. woke up one day and said nobody should fetch water from that borehole. No, the, no, the, no. The, the, the borehole that her husband opened for, for our wives and children imagine? to be getting water from. You see, see what I'm thinking now, my elders. Uh -huh. I suggest that we summon Obina, her first son, and talk to him about this. What do you think? Uh, you have a point there. Yes. But um, we have to let Ibekwe know as their uncle, yeah. uh, Ibekwe will be the one to summon them. Yeah, Better yes. like that. You are correct. In that regards, I think I will have to go to Ibekwe's house uh. to inform him about our, the outcome of this meeting with Ijenjo uh -huh. and what will result. Yes, we have to. Listen what she said. 
I have traveled not. I've traveled here. I've traveled. Does she know where I have traveled to? What does, she, from know? Navinija? What does she know? What is this? Uh, um, she called us uh, Shokoloko Bangos. What is Shokoloko Bangos? Okay, now Shokoloko. People are living here. You won't know. So why is she calling us that? Uh, no, no. Are we Shokoloko? Which, which one of us resembles Shokoloko Those Bangos? Those are not such now. No women with their tops. Shokoloko Bangos. A whole lot that's like us. <laughs> Day, Chase. Are you doing, Masa? Where are you guys going to fetch We are going to our stream since Ejen do stop us from coming to our house. Very soon we shall solve that problem. Eh? Is your father at home? Yes, he's at home. Okay, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. I will call him, but there will be later in the day because I am sure that by now he must be busy with office work. We must find out from him if they are in support of their mother's wickedness to us. I suggested to her, let us be contributing money to use the money in paying the Nepal bills. Or better still, to buy fuel whenever there is power at it so that we can use it in pumping the water. But she bluntly refused. She disagreed. She came with this attitude from her father's house. Have you forgotten how they treated us when we went to marry her? Or have you forgotten how she ended our classmen visit to Elendo's house in the city? I still remember. Have you? This woman is something else. Have you seen any of our children visiting Elendo's Elendo's house. At least for holidays, like every other children do. Not at all. All these are because of our wickedness. Immediately Elendo died, this woman disconnected all the taps outside the compound. Is Ijen a human being at all? You see, we have to talk to the children so that they would advise their mother to stop all this unwarranted uh, behavior. Else, we will summon both of them. Have you seen Obina's wife in this village since she was married to this family? Have you? You mean the first son? Because the younger brother is not yet married. Yes, the first son, Obina. The first son. He didn't fought that girl simply because when she put to bed, she called her mother immediately. And she had to go to her son's house, fought her in-law. Her daughter-in-law had to beat her up and threw her out of the house. How come I didn't hear about all this, all this while? Yes, because you have been busy with your railway office work. Was it not two years ago that you retired and come back to the village to stay with us? We have been tolerating her stupid characters. All the rubbish has been given to us, all this while. But I'm going to invite her son. We are going to talk over this extensively. We must talk over it. You are right. Of course I did. I gave Horst 250,000 Naira 
and he promised to help us talk to the consultants so that they can favor us in the finance. The consultants called me demanding for 500,000 or be ready for a showdown during the evaluation. What? So that white boy betrayed us. I will strangle him to death. Danny, don't. Stop. Listen, what are you saying? I gave that white boy 250,000 naira and he didn't deliver. You are here asking me to stop. How? Come down. You see, we. In this business of ours, negotiation and diplomacy is more important than influence. It's high time you checked. It's your temper thing. Yes. We need host in this business. He did businesses with that. And he's been helpful to us since he took over the company. He's a professional in engineering. Quite civil engineering, I guess. We are not. So we need him. I don't think it would be right if we put up any fight with him. Hmm? My point is this. He is dad's friend and also a partner of this company. So the least he should do is to defend us during the finance. Talk to the consultants. Do whatever it takes. Oh, no, he didn't. Is the 500,000 naira negotiable? Of course it is. What we can offer is 400,000. Trust me. I'm sorry I didn't do this to your satisfaction. Yeah, madam. So you have been going around the village telling people that I got you pregnant. How? Why shouldn't I? He cannot tell me why shouldn't I? When you want to sleep with all the girls in this village. See, I'm trying to help and tame that your manhood. So you can sit at a place and think about your life. My friend, nothing is wrong with my life. Just leave me alone. Is it by force? I don't want to date you anymore. Since your father wants to kill me. You going around the village, pium, 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 telling people, your friends, that I got you pregnant will not even stop anything. Don't worry, when my stomach is out, then we shall know. I have not done anything with you for over six months now. If you are actually pregnant for me, Iken Nawu Ogogo, everybody should have seen the protruding stomach by now. So if you are jealous that I want to date other girls, be very careful with me and let me be. Don't worry, when the time comes, we shall know who owns the pregnancy. Look at you. Look at Madam. Okay. I want you to warn your friend Rosemary. She will not like what I will do to her next time I hear that she is still castigating my name. Why are you complaining to me? When I told you to leave that girl alone, what did you tell me? No, what did you tell me? Now you want me, Amara, to go and warn Rosemary. I won't try it. I met her a few hours ago and she maintained she is pregnant. For who? For me, he can now go go. Okay, I knew her from you. So go and want her for me. <laughs> Let the God save you that she's not pregnant. 
or she's playing pranks with you because her father will not spare you her father will make you mad it's like you don't know who her father is you have been jumping from one woman to the other since you came back from the city now you have channeled your good character to goma or you think i don't know yeah okay baby. if you get me angry eh i will condemn you don't you have respect for your elder brother <laughs> <laughs> hey, the elder brother. So if they should call elder brothers now to come out, you too, you will come out. Elder brother. You have gone to the city three good times and you are back to this village with nothing to show for it. Why other boys are seeing their master's house hustling? Now you are here asking me to go and one rose. Continue. I didn't get you here, Alo. Don't don't tempt me. I'm warning you. Don't try me. Please stop pointing at me. Oh yeah, come and hit me now. No, come and hit me. I don't even know what you're doing in this house. You are not useful. You contribute nothing to this house. You see this food I'm, I'm cooking. You're not going to taste it. You're not going to eat it. Humanizer. No, Kualewa. Nonsense. Hello, Uncle Ibekwe. When did that one start again? It's okay, it's okay. I will discuss with my younger brother and we'll both come to the village. Just calm down, Biko. Hmm? All right. Bueno. Bell. It's okay. Uh, welcome, baby. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> you know, <laughs> there's so much good news. Share with me. Yeah. Uh, I, I hope you know that. You know, each of my sisters has been married for 10 years. Yeah. 10 years. Without even a trace of a child. Yes. I didn't even know she was pregnant. Mm. Yes. Because she never told me. And neither did she tell any of my sisters. And just this morning, mm -hmm. I mean, <laughs> this morning, yeah. she sent me her pregnancy footage. Yeah, stating that uh, she was sorry mm -hmm. not to have diverged due to the fact that her pastor actually warned her not to until she's pretty best. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. I just had a set of twins last night. Beautiful. <laughs> and guess what? Mm -hmm. As a boy and a girl. Oh. And I'm so happy. You should be easy. Yes. <laughs> you know what? Wow, wow. <laughs> this is good news. Yes. You know what? I will put a call across to her immediately. Uh, thank you so much. Welcome, welcome. Uh, you know, Dana. first thing tomorrow morning, yeah. I'm off to Abuja to be with her. Uh -huh. I, and you know, uh, since our mother is no more, mm. I should go look after her and the kids. And I already packed. A packed? Yes. Well, I don't have a problem with that. All you need to do for me is, for everything I'll be needing, okay. prepare and store in the fridge. Done. That's all. Done already. Done? Yes. Oh, and Stephanie. I'll leave him with my baby, Sandra. Mm. <laughs> Sandra, you want to leave with your mommy? Yes. Sure? <laughs> you want to. <laughs> Sir? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Come no, 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 no. <laughs> Yes. Had enough, eh? Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. You can see. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'll miss you guys. Yeah, you know, since our mother is no more. Yeah. I have to go be with her. What's here? We agreed that we are clothing tonight. So why the sudden change of mind? What happened? Danny. I'm no longer interested in clubbing. Yes. I changed my mind. You see, 
In fact, my wife traveled to the north to see the sister who gave birth to a set of twins. It does not mean I should start hobnobbing with sinners of the night. I'm a married man, responsible married man at that. And I want you to start thinking about settling down too. Yeah, understandable you had a relationship with a girl who double dated, got pregnant and you got heartbroken. Of course, anybody in your shoes won't feel fine, but it is not enough to be living irresponsibly. I want you as my brother to start thinking about settling down this year. Very important. So, Anike, now your problem. Once Konji hold you like this, you will say, man, we'll go ball. Once you don't drop, calm down, you're going to begin to speak English. You don't want to hop, knob. What are you saying? So I'm not the sinner, eh? St. Toby, no verse. Sleep. Let me go and sin peacefully. You see that club? I'm going to club. Then you go home and rest. Arab Ronko, go home and rest. You had a busy day at the office now. Define rest. I choose how I want to rest. Clubbing by, might be my own way of resting. So stop. Uncle uh, Bikwe called me and they talked about Mama and the ball. Obina, you are the first son. You must not involve me in everything. You can handle all that. Yeah, but we're still brothers. Two heads, he says, better than one. So how do we? What do we do about? The borehole, papa dog for the people. I mean, how do they call What do we do about letting them get for that? No, be every family meeting. Second son, they come. Obina, you are Elendo's first son. Handle all that. Meanwhile, we are the club. Oh. <laughs> Danny, you will never change. I'm telling you. You will just never change. Same Danny, 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 Danny. Remember, I woke up as long as we came. All right. Linda, how are you? I'm fine. Remind me that your name again. I'm Daniel. Oh, Harry is that gentleman, brother Obina, right? Yeah. Obina is fine. Obina is fine. Okay. Please, I'm looking for your friend, Precious. Oh, Precious? Yes. She's hooked up tonight. I saw her leave with a client. 
30 minutes ago. Since she's not here, shall we? No, no, no. I'm not here for Uko. I need, um, where can I find Precious? I gave her my card, but she has not called me since then. Uh, maybe she has been busy with customers ever since then. Why worry about her? Hmm? A night with me will make you forget about her. No, no calm down. That, this is not why I'm here. I'm not here for hookup, okay? I need Precious. Where can I find her? She's not in town. Please help me with her whereabouts. I just said she's not in town. Okay, can I have her number, please? I don't have a number. You don't have your friend's number. Mm -hmm. You don't have your friend's number. It's not true. Um, you know, she didn't tell me where she was traveling to. And ever since then, I've been calling her, trying to reach her. She, she has not been responding to her calls, so I don't know. So, in a nutshell, she traveled. She did not go for any hookup. Huh? Did she tell you where she was traveling to? She didn't tell me where she was traveling to. Like I said before. Okay, fine. Can I have her number, please? I know you have it, please. Okay, fine. Thank you very much. Trust me, I'm not here for hookup. If I'm here for hookup, zero I'll eight carry. zero. No worries, let me just. Thanks. Yes, no, 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 I'm not here for hookup. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now, <laughs> very soon, <clears throat> I got be able to go my. Ah. You know what that means now? <laughs> ah, brother, no, 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 it's not now. I want to be through with my studies first. Yes, of course, you'll be through with your studies. And let me tell you, if I ever come here and see anybody hanging around here, eh? Okay, my hand up, what Ooh, ooh, Mbonya, shoot the person. Brother, story, Akuko. You that don't even come to the village often. Is it when you are in the city that you will know? You don't even want me to come to the city. So tell me, how will you see anybody close to me? Ah, Mua mm. doesn't want you to come to the city. No, now. That is not possible. Feel free to call me anytime. Call me, call Daniel. I mean, we are, we are, we are yours too. Nobody can stop you from coming to see us. Okay? Okay. After all, my father trained your elder ones, isn't it? Yes, you're uh -huh. correct. But I have good news for you. Good news? Yes. Share me, share, share. I can't wait. What's I've, the good news? <laughs> I've gained admission. My, oh my. You've gained admission. Congratulations. On which of the institutions? Federal College Umunze on a degree course. Wow. Federal College Umunze on a degree. You see what I'm saying? You see why you need to be close to me? You see why you need to be close to my wife? You see, when, you, when you're far away from us, you allow my wife's relations to be taking things that belong to you. If you know what that means. I know, brother. Good. Okay, I promise I'll be coming close now. Good, good. Hey, <laughs> what about your father? Um, he went to Okonko's house to get pan wine. Um, Okonko's house. Please, can you go over there and tell him I'm here, I'm waiting for him? Okay, sure. Okay. Please, just make yourself comfortable. I'm coming back. I should make myself comfortable in my own house. <laughs> but I hope you bought something for me, oh. Ugo, go and call your father. <laughs> ah, who 
Look at my sister. She's grown into a beautiful woman. Where are you going to our Samwam? My uncle is at our house and I'm going to call my father. Okay, wait. Let me tell you something before you go. What is it? Nke okay, I've told you to go and carry your importation from Rosemary and leave me alone. This girl has actually spoiled my name among these village sweet girls. Kai! What should I do to that idiot? So how did you go? He's not there. Oh. Okonko said he left for the palace to see the Igwe. And the palace is very far. I can't trek there. He didn't even go with his phone because we don't have light for like two weeks now. Mm. I would have called him. It's okay. Uh, don't worry, okay? Don't worry. Just tell him I was here. Let me go see my mother. But I will sure see him before I go back to the city. Okay. Mm. Are you going back today? Sure, sure, Will. Sure, Will. Um. Don't forget all I told you. Hmm? You know you are the last born and uh, you've been the one taking care of Papa. But remember, you still have others. Hmm? Try and be visiting them. You know, go. I will, brother. But it's very, very important. I will. That'll ring me. Yes, brother. Thank so, you. Let me be on my way now. Okay, brother. Mm -hmm. Wait, brother, is it when you come back that you bring what you bought? <laughs> Ugo ma. Well, let me. Oh, oh, okay. Can you join me to the car? Yes, sir. So that I would do something for you. Okay, brother. You will never stop. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Good day, uncle. Good day, my son. No need to ask. You are looking good. Thank you, uncle. Thank you. I I went to your house, but uh, Ugoma told me you were not at home. That you went to see uh, Okonko. She went there and said you were not there. Oh, I'm sorry, my son. I left his house for the palace. Okay. And that's where I'm coming from. What can we do? Can we go to my house? No, Uncle, no. I, I have a limited time. I want to go and see my mother. Hey, come to think of it. You complained about my mother. So, don't you think this is the best time to go see her together? So we'll sort everything out before her. My son, you are making sense. In that case, uh, let me keep this and quickly meet you here now. All right. Hello, precious. You've been snubbing my call, right? Why are you sobbing? It's okay, stop crying. Where are you at? Yes, how do I locate where you are now? All right. Let me greet you. I just greeted you, man. You didn't answer. Oh, by force, you pray. Is it by force to respond? And do you, Ibepe? You think I will change my mind by bringing him here? Upe. My other stance. Mama. And why did you break Ugoma's gallon and spill the water she fetched from her uncle's house? Why? Was this question why you left your office at the city to come and ask me? Someone answer that question. 
Do you have any problem with Uncle Ibekwe? Apart from the land you told me he cleared. And he went ahead to cultivate on that land after the meeting we had. You couldn't do anything. First son for that matter. Mama. But you had nothing to do with that land. Uncle Ibekwe here is a farmer. He's been using it. If you want another land, tell me. If you want to use any land, I will give you land. Why are you asking me? Eh? Obina, are you saying I cannot protect my husband's property? I don't blame you. I know you hate your mother. I do not blame you. I will blame God. Because if he had given me a female child, I will not be here talking this nonsense with this thing since she's never. That's why you planned with your wife to beat up your mother and you couldn't do anything about it. Don't worry. I have said what I want to say. I do not want them to fetch water from that borehole again. And that is final. Come, come. Kenki na posi my wife up here. Why are you calling her name? Kenki na we have What concerns her what we are saying? Mama, listen, listen. Like you rightly said, I am the first son. And by virtue of that, whatever my dad was doing when he was alive, I take over. Mama, I'm in charge here, not you. I said not anymore. If you want your clan people to be fetching water there, take a book hole for them at the village square. Not this one, my husband, as an eye dog. It was my father who dug that borehole, and not you. He was benevolent enough to say, okay, villagers, come and be fetching water. How the hell does it affect you? He was my husband before he became your father. Yeah. Yes. If not for my help, on what on your body now? Well, I have lost my appetite because saliva and sarasa. Yeah, I know you are hungry. I know. Let me give this to my dog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Listen, when you are done sitting and blabbing, eh? Just take him where you brought him from. I don't want to see you this here. This is not my father's legacy. Mama, this is not my father's legacy. My father was a good man. Don't spoil his legacy. He was a good man, was I? Yes! Was I? Have you for once asked me what I had wanted? As a woman, as a mother. Why would you convert this man to come here and start talking nonsense? You should have come here first, asked me what happened, and not going to his house to bring him. Give your nazo for son and nanketinabo. He is your uncle, yes. But your mother should come first before your uncle. No suckability. Don't forget to lock my gate. What's going on? Oh, what is all this? What is going on? Is what has gone wrong? Oh, I, I, I am sorry about this, okay? But I will show our hand. I understand. We have been seen that here. I don't understand, Obina. Don't worry. I'll handle it, okay? I'll handle it. Let me go. No, I'll, I'll handle it. I'll handle go, it. Let me go. I can't understand. My father was not like this. I can't now. understand. Let's, let's go. What changed my mother? Uncle, Uncle, <laughs> Robin, it is good you saw her. Match. This is what we have been passing through since she came back to reside in this village. Your father was my elder brother. Did he ever show you any land that belongs to him personally? No, he did not. That was because we lived in peace. Your father was a nice man. We have not shared any property. I want you to hold that peace like your father did. Do not let your wife or your mother talk ill of your relations. You can see what a woman that, 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 that is married into this family is doing. Uh, don't worry, uncle. Don't worry. Hmm? Don't worry. I will talk to my younger brother to talk to her too. And I believe so much that she will listen to him. Hmm? Please, just calm down. We'll sort it out. Uh, 
can I drop you off as I'll be leaving for the city immediately? Let's not forget. How is your wife and your daughter Sandra? Uh, are they back from the Amugo? No, they are not back yet. But hopefully, they'll be back soon. No, that is all right. That is all right, my dear. Okay, Uncle. Uh, let me drop you off now. Eh? All right. Don't worry, I, I so much believe that my younger brother would uh, talk sense into him. Mm -hmm. So just take it easy. Bro, mom is being unnecessarily wicked and I don't like it. Come on, this is just water. We have it already. It's not like it's deducting money while people are fetching. So why are you stopping people from fetching water? Eh? The last time I intervened, she slapped me. I was like, mom, come down, let them... I didn't tell you. Mama, I'm Agola. You didn't tell me. You got home, you didn't tell me. Mom slapped me because I asked her to let people fetch water. That water is free. Do you know the most annoying part? The one she did to our cousin, Ugoma. I'm telling you. I mean, water is water. That's the least we can give back to the people. In return, why is she holding it as if her life depends on it? I will drive down to the village and talk some senses into mom. In giving you receive, yeah. she come down and beg. You truly, you truly have to. You really have to go home and talk to mama. This is getting out of hand, you know, right? Mama is destroying Papa's legacy. Papa was a good man. That's Papa's legacy. Papa created that boho so that people in the village can fetch water for free. Oh. Now Papa is dead. Mama is saying nobody should fetch water. How will Papa be feeling in his grief? She was not like this when Papa was alive. Papa knew the village needed water. Abi? What is water? What is boho? We have it. Let people fetch. They are hugging us. The money is balancing. I have to have it. See, Joanna. Hmm? It's just try and talk to her and I hope she listens to you. Yeah, come here. So how did it go? Not too well, sir. Mr. Stephen has not completed the document, and I told him how urgent we might be in need of it. What is the meaning of this? I don't understand. What kind of report is this? And when did Mr. Stephen bring in this one? This morning, sir. This morning. Can I go back to you? So where have you been? I've been searching for you everywhere this time. I haven't went to that club where we picked you people that night. I met your friend. She gave me your number. But each time I call that number, a man picks and speaks in Bibio. A man? Uh -huh. Are you married? That's a joke. Can I see the number? Is this not your number? Now you make mistake now. What's your number? My number is 23, not 32. Oh, ah, 23, no? My bad. Ah, I foresee. This time I call that man will be like, wait, wait, he speaks what I don't understand. And he's so rude. Goodness like you. Yes. Come on. Let's not go there, please. You look stressed out. What has been happening to you? Where have you been? I was like, you got that. Come on, where? 
whose whereabouts is not important to a rich guy like you. Calm down. Calm down. Your friend told me you traveled. She, she should as well told you where I went to. Listen, 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 Daniel. I am not in, interested in this conversation. I'm not in the right frame of mind for this. Honestly, I didn't want to talk to you. The moment I left your house, I threw your card away. It was Linda that forced me to make this conversation happen. Please, I'm not interested in anything that has to do with this conversation. I can see your face. You don't like when a woman talks to you like that? Yes, but I will forgive you. I'm interested in you. So you travel to the village to see your parents? Or what? Well... I went to the village. Oh, I see. I don't have any parents. Your parents stay in the village? I don't have any parents. How possible is that you don't have any parents? Did you fall from the sky? What do you mean by that? My mom is dead. And I don't know who my father is. What? Your mom is dead and you don't know who your father is. Yes. That's serious. So who raised you? My granny. She raised me through nursery, primary, secondary university education. Your granny did all that? Yes. That means you have a rich granny there. You will not understand. You won't understand. Because she's sick. She's sick. It's okay, please stop crying. Okay? Stop crying. <laughs> How serious is her sickness? She's dying. <laughs> My grandmother is dying. A problem shared is half solved. It's okay. It's okay. A problem shared is how solved. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Stop crying. What is precious talking about? That her grandmother is dying. How does she want to pull the fast one on me? Because I've been looking for her? No. She can't. The pain on her face was real. But why am I even bothered? I mean, she's just a one night stand girl. Or better still, uncomfortable her trying to be nice. Yes, yes, Danny. I've been trying to call you all evening. I guess the network was messy. No connect. Yes, I... I want to find out how far you've gone with those files I gave you. They called immediately you left. Yes, yes. The date for the presentation has been shifted. Yes. Yes, so. <laughs> Ooh, four days earlier. Four days earlier. Mm. So you know what? I would want everything to be ready before Tuesday. You know why? The presentation is on Wednesday. So I really want you to expedite action so you get everything set. So that I'll be prepared from my own angle. Hmm? It's okay. It's okay. Let's try and do your best, eh? All right, no. Is it okay? Okay, bye. Uh -huh. So, you mean Ijen who said all this? In the presence of Webina, her first son, and he could not do anything about it. 
What do you expect the young man to do? To start fighting his mother? No. But he could have done something as Elendo's first son. No. That one is not important. In my presence, he told her to allow the people get access to the borough. Uh -huh. And still she refused. She really refused. But the problem here is, when a young man who is grown to get married is about to marry, he will leave all the grown-up girls within his community and run to a different land to get a wife. If Ijendo had come from this community and knew how hard it is for our children to get water, she shouldn't have been behaving this way. You're right. You're right, my brother, because I know how much your mother tried for hmm. Lendo to marry from this community. But he refused. Huh. But what can we do? There's nothing we can do. The borehole in question is in her compound. So there's nothing anybody can do about it until she decides on what to do with the borehole. Huh. Though I've spoken to Obina hmm? to tell his younger brother so that they can speak with their mother. But the issue is, will this woman listen to them? Huh. Will she? Huh. Did you see the doctor when you got there? Yes, I did. It's okay. Stop crying. Oh. 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 I'm still alive. You know? Did did the doctor deduct anything from the money he charged us? No, he did not. And then he said it is very expensive. It's okay. God is still alive. Oh. He knows the best. And I know, I am very, very sure that he will favor us. You know? Stop crying. Stop crying. Oh. Stop crying. Oh. Hello? Good morning, Danny. Doing any better this morning. My wood is crashing. <laughs> you want to come? Okay. I'll, I'll just send a direction to you now. You see, with more seriousness, you'll be through by Tuesday. You see, as it is now, my head is full. I need to clay it off some cobwebs. Yes. And you believe everything will be ready by Tuesday? Are you aware that today is Friday? Yes. I'm aware. I'm aware. I'm aware. Okay. Oh. Go while and let me see what I can do. Please. Please, do something, do something. You know how serious we need that job? You know it. Please, expedite action so we don't lose out on that job. Hmm? Good.
Anyone? Nobody tell me. 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 Nobody Nobody tell Will you come here? Uh, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. You don't have respect. What are these? Okay. Is um, your urine or a goat came here? No, I took I took water to wash my pot. You know, I just finished the obono soup I cooked um, a week ago. So I washed every everything. I washed every yourself. So that's why all this water they are here. You took water. You washed my, my pot. You took. Did you measure it? Measure. Yes. How many liters did you fetch? Yeah. I just opened it. I just opened it up. Open it. Yeah. I will deduct it from your salary. It's very small. Though. The water is small. The water is small compared to these ones here. Look at the floor. I don't blame you. When next I am going out, I will load this with key. I will measure the water for you. I know you will be waiting. That man is also called Doorman in UK. Do I blame you? I am no longer a teacher. If not, I will just enroll you in my school and vlog the hell out of you. Shoko no kobango. This woman, eh? I'm just bag of trouble. Bag of trouble. I will just pack my 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 bag and go. You can't think with this one. I've told you before, she will be fine. Calm down. Your grandma will be fine. She's in safe hands. So I can't see in the office. It's just a lump in her left breast. Due to negligence, it has become cancerous. When Precious came here the first time, after paying for the lab and all that, I told her that this woman, she needs to be operated on. Else the cancer will develop and it will degenerate to the other one. Is it that serious? Yes, it is very serious. And what she needs now is a surgical operation. Will she survive it? At her age, the chances are 50-50. As you can see, this is a village hospital. We can transfer her to the city where they have modern equipment.
So you called him? Yes. Where is Daniel? Has he been to the office today? No, I've not seen him today, sir. Did he call or drop any message for me? Not at all, sir. His number has not been reachable. What's going on? I've been trying his line without getting any response. It's okay. Just, just. Okay, Call him again. Try his line. Try his line. Try his number. Okay, if you sir. get him, tell him to I said he should come to the office immediately. All right, sir. All right. Mm -hmm. Stop crying, okay? Crying will not solve anything. The doctor said Mama Nuku has breast cancer. And the only way she will survive is surgery. Surgery? So how did Mama Nuku get breast cancer now? <laughs> how did she get breast cancer? Pressures calm down. Shedding tears will not solve any problem. Okay. The doctor says she needs surgery, so let's think about how to raise the money. Okay. So, how much the doctor says it's going to cost? The doctor said the surgery will cost 2.5 million naira. What? Ah! I then the will come. Oh my God, who now? Where do you want me to get 2.5 million naira for? How do you want me to do this? Calm down, calm down, calm down. It's not your fault. Calm down. I will help you. Yes. Help me. But on one condition. You must promise me that you will never go back to that place. All in the name of looking for money. I know what you want me to do. How do you want me to get money to take care of my man? Look. Eh? Listen, I'm going to steal any amount of money just to take care of my grandmother. You don't have to steal. You don't understand! That's not you. Can't, okay, even if you decide to keep sleeping with men, how many men are you going to sleep with to raise such a month from one who is so true? I know that's not who you are. You say you will not understand. That woman you see paid for my nursery school, my degree. She suffered so for me. So you. I would do anything to make sure my nuku is alive. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Don't worry, follow me to my car, okay? I will transfer some money for you or maybe to the doctor so that they can proceed. Yes. But I repeat on one condition. You will never stand anywhere again. Or you will never go out trying to sleep with any man all in the name of raising money. Do you understand? Deal. Thank you. Yes, coming. Have you administered the drugs on her? Yes, doctor. Please keep an eye on her. Check the drips and give her injection afterwards. Okay, doctor. The patient will want to meet your attention. Alright, I'm coming. Have you been? I've been calling you all day. Sorry for not picking your calls. I was busy. <sighs> you remember Precious? Pregnant. Precious. We forgot her. We went to see her granny. She's sick. Thanks, She's not a girl you picked from the club the other day. She's the one. Her mother is sick. You need to see her condition. Danny. Danny, how could you abandon work in the office? How could you abandon work to tell me you took 
a slut to see her sick mother. Is she the man? She's not a slut. Take a good look at her. Isn't she beautiful? I feel like wiping this loud smile off your face. Yes, I feel like doing that. What's wrong with you? I expect you to know that there's a difference between pleasure and business. They don't go together. We didn't go there for pleasure. I said we went to see her sick granny. Danny. Danny. Take that girl back to the brothel where she belongs. Yes. I don't ever want to set my eyes on her again. And lastly, make sure those fires are ready by Monday. Excuse me. Danny, make sure you return this girl back to the brothel. Don't ever want to set my eyes on her again. Work first. Excuse me. You know what? I'll just leave. I mean, I heard everything your brother said. And I don't want to be the one to distract you from work, so. Excuse me. Am I the one that said that? Am I the one that said that? Come on. Don't let that get to you. Sit. Don't let what he said get to you, okay? <laughs> you should be bothered only when I say such. Now you called me. Danny, what is the meaning of this? Danny, what is the meaning of this? You withdrew a 500,000 from my account with Philmont Bank and a 100,000 naira yesterday. What is happening? And so, is that supposed to be a problem? Danny, you asked me if that is supposed to be a problem? Obin, I don't get it. Am I supposed to come lick your ass before withdrawing money from an account I'm signatory to? Danny, what did you do with the money? That's none of your business. I needed the money. Besides, we have over 25 million naira cash in that account. I'm not even talking of um, other assets and properties. So what's the biggie? Danny, but you know what we're passing through now. Is that supposed to be my problem? What are we passing through? On whose effort? Danny, on whose effort? That was daddy's effort! Come on! How can you do this? We are trying to reduce, I mean, cut down on expenses, and you're doing this? Calm down, bro. This is not your money. Stop being authoritative. It's our father's money. Company's money, family wealth. So calm down, it's not your money. We are trying to cut down on expenses. But your wife is living with the work. Your daughter's school fees is on the high side. All from the company's account. Have I ever complained? So why are you making noise because I took this away? Okay. If we need to cut down on necessary expenses, Start from your wife and your daughter. Then you can talk to me. Danny, and what do you want to do? You want to walk out on me? Danny, cut down on your expenses. If you continue like this, you will bring down this company. You don't do things that way. You don't know that you risk 600,000 naira just in the space of one week. You didn't tell me. What's, what's wrong? You want to push us to bankruptcy? Danny, you need to calm down. You need to organize yourself. This is not right. What's going on? Sir, is everything okay? I overheard you shouting. <sighs> it 
It's okay, it's okay. Just go back to your office. Tell the field manager to see me immediately. Okay. Well, sir, whatever it is, please do take it easy. Don't <laughs> no, worry, I'll handle it. I'll handle it. Hmm? I'll handle it. Okay. Sir, so, yes. he's your younger brother and I have taken time to watch him. He still thinks he is good. Or probably he doesn't want to be serious with the establishment. Just follow him with wisdom. Say some wisdom. Choke some wisdom till when? I mean, some wisdom till when? Chooks, look at you. You're married with kids. Are you older than Daniel? I don't think so. Yes, he had a girlfriend when he was in school. And the girl left him for a white guy she met online. Since then, Danny hates women. Telling him about marriage sounds like a taboo to him. All he does is hobnob with different girls in different clubs in town. Different clubs? Yeah. That is really serious. Then you have to talk to your mother about it. Let your mother talk some sense into Daniel. My point here is, you shouldn't be harsh on Daniel. Just give him time, he will change. Be calm with him. I've not been harsh to him. I've been trying to speak sense into him. You see, what hurts me now is that my, my late father will not be happy wherever he is. This was not his legacy. Not at all. There you go. I, I understand where you're going to. Just be calm, sir. Things should be fine. I mean, with time, that they will match up. I know, but remember, time is of the essence. Time is of the essence. I also feel your face. Time is of the essence. Mama. Hmm. I brought food for you. So you can eat. I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not hungry. Ma, you have to eat, though. No, Mama, you have to eat. I brought food for you, so you have to eat. You need to eat food. And now, you go. Stand up so you can eat something. You have to try and eat a little bit, okay? At least something has to enter your tummy. Sorry, Mama. Go. Mama, I think we have to bring Jacoby back. You need more attention now. You need too much attention now, and I know that Chikube is still going to school and how hard things are, but Mama, please, she has to come back. I took her away so that things will be easier for us. Bringing her back will add to expenses in this family. Yeah. My, my surgery requires a huge amount of money. Bringing Chekwe back, we add to it. Mama, Chekube has to come back. My friend Daniel gave me money for the surgery. Everything. So at least we have some time to breathe another fresh air. Mama, while I'm hustling to look for money, Chekube has to cook food for you. So she has to come back. Wait. Did you just say that 
Someone gave you money for my surgery? Yes, Mama. Yes. You now have money for my surgery? Mama, I have money for your surgery now. So I'm going to meet the doctor to know the next movement. Precious woman. Precious woman. Hey. You have tried so much for your grandmother. You have done so much for me. Hey. What would I have done without you? Yeah? Since this sickness started, you have been toiling day and night. Hey! That's okay. Hey! 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 You know how this sickness started? You know how it will end. Mama, I am sure you will see me through. Mama, it's okay. Now, it's time for you to be happy. At least help us come from above. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll go and see the dog. Mama, you have to eat enough food now. Enough food. Mm -hmm. Keep the food later we eat. I don't have appetite. Mama, you have to. After everything, you still don't have appetite. Yeah, we have it, we come. But you have to eat, Joe. No. You can't waste this food now. Do you... No, no, no. See, keep it in the drawer here. In four days' time. Because the team went for a conference. All you have to do is to make payments. Take it to what I have to make payment to you. No. The team have an account. You can make payment to the account. Can I have the account? Sure, the will give it to you. Doctor, it seems you're part of the team. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are all surgeon. We form the team. So for us to help people with such cases, to free them for such deadly disease. Don't worry, your grandmother will be fine. Danny, how was your day? Fine. How is Mama Nuku? Mama Nuku is here. I just got to tell you what the doctor said about her movement. Okay, I'm listening. The doctor said that Mama Nuku will be leaving for her surgery on Thursday. Okay. Have you made the payment? Yes, I have. Danny. Thank you. about everything you did. And she would love to see you. You know, she's so relieved. I see her life come back. That the God will bless you for standing for Mama Nuku, for doing everything for her. God will bless you. That is nothing. God will never, ever, ever leave your side. It's okay. It's okay. You're crying. You would understand. The man look is all I've got. Don't worry. I'll tell you. Someday. <laughs> I hope my man look is not seeing your tears. Oh, she's sleeping. Good. Relax, okay? Everything will be fine. At least now. You have me, and Mama Nuku will be fine. Thank you.
Now I can kill you here and nobody will know. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. What did I do? So you don't know what you have been doing after my warning to you. And that is why you're threatening me with death, Okoya. See, I don't want to have anything to do with you again. Can't you understand? I heard you were at the market yesterday calling my name that I made you pregnant. Look, don't tempt me. I have warned you earlier. Don't tempt me. Okay now. Are you not supposed to be happy that I want to make a first and an only son like you have an offspring? Hmm? Secondly, you're supposed to be happy that you have been confirmed a man. Do you know how many men in this village who cannot impregnate a woman? Eh? And you're here warning me. Did you're I warning me. Did I beg no, you? I know what to do. Did I you want to kill me up here? Did I beg you to confirm if I'm a man? You think I don't know that I am a man? I know that I am a man. Let this be the last warning I'll give to you. You know how to mark her name. Don't worry, I know what to do. You want to kill me up here? Don't worry. I'm going to go fuck you. Amarachi. Amarachi. Why are you killing your brother? Warn him. I know why I'm keeping quiet on all his threats. I just left him now and he threatened to kill me. Do you know I can walk quietly to the police station, make an entry and they'll come and pick him up? Do you know that? I don't understand what is happening between you and my brother Ikenna. You said you're pregnant for my brother and my brother said he's not responsible. To me, I don't want all these things. I told me I don't want. Everybody in this community have heard it from you. Even if you're pregnant, must you go around announcing it? Are you not a woman? Don't you have shame? Hi. I'm actually the one saying this to me. Don't I have shame? I don't say it to any other person apart from Ugoma, who is a friend. And your brother wants to date her, so I should keep quiet up, yeah? And you're saying, if, if I'm not ashamed. So what do you want now? To marry my brother or what? I don't know. He's your brother. Both of you should plan on the next thing to do before I will terminate this pregnancy. Are you aware that his master sent him back to this village? And since then, he has nothing doing. So how will he take care of you? That is not my business. It does not concern me at all. It does not. Whether he does anything you know, or he jumps up and down, me, I don't care. All I know is that you people should come and see my people. Else I will think of the next thing to do. And you know what that means. Amrachi, you know what that means. Talk to you can now. Talk to you can now. <laughs> hey, okay. If I'm not ashamed, you're asking me. Okay. Whatever your plans are, just be very careful, please. Hey. Oh God, what is all this? <sighs> so what do you want to do now? Because you don't even know your left from your right. You see all the girls in this community, it was Rose that you got pregnant. What is wrong with Rose? Is she not a human being? Then why are you running? Your goods are back. Go and clear them now. Your goods are back. Hey. I did think Mama is still alive. So this is all she will be seeing. Hey. Mama will be weeping in her grave. Don't worry. Very soon I will leave this community for you. So you can just, you will do whatever you want with yourself. Yeah. Amarachi. Enough of this. If Rose insists that she's pregnant, fine. Let her have the child. Then we proceed from there and know who is responsible for that pregnancy. Let me warn you. Let this be the last time I will see her in this house. Or even use my name round the village. Because I will not spare her. I will not. You are just backing for nothing. You are just raising your voice for nothing. Better go and carry your goose. Your goose have landed. Go and carry it. Are you sure of 
what you're saying. I, I beware. Have I water in my mouth? You see that woman, Ijendo. She's a wicked woman who doesn't like anything good coming from this woman now. And her reasons, nobody can tell. Ugo, ma. Ugo? Papa. Nem, come. Nem. Ah, good day, sir. Aha, no. Ugo, ma, kedo. I'm fine, sir. Adam. Since you and Wokafo are closer, please, I want you to go and stylishly find out if there are other people who fetches water from that house. Please. Ah, ah, Papa. It's not something she's hiding now. She allows people to fetch water. Are you not aware that Mbafo is from her own side? And she allows all the children from that side to fetch water from her bottle. You see? You see? Nobody ever told me this. I don't know. I am not aware. Yeah. I don't know what we did to her. I don't know. You see? Ah. Except that um, on the day of her traditional marriage, mm -hmm. Uh, there was too much rain mm -hmm. and um, most of us left because we couldn't wait for her to dress up yes. and display in her traditional regalia. Uh -huh. uh, apart from that, I don't know what we did to her. But that is not an issue. I was there. You know how long I was in the hospital because of pneumonia complications? Yes, I'm aware. Huh? Ada, hmm, Papa? go. Uh, okay. Okay, sir. Thank you. Okay, my brother. I am getting angry because of this news. Mm. Okay, I am getting seriously angry. I must react. Uh, what of Daniel? Has he visited the village since that time? That one? He has not. And I am seriously angry about that. Because I don't know why. And when I will react now, he will come here to protect her. But I must react. Yes. Okonkwa, I must react. You must do something. Okonkwa, you must, I must react. You must do something. What is the problem with these children? You must do something. What kind of family is this? Mama put you up in the room. Well, you know why you're a bitch. Take it easy. I gave up the instruction. They must stop. Mama, I look at me. Put you up in the room. Take it easy. I gave up the instruction. Get this water from from Ijendo's house. From Ijendo's house. For how long have you been fetching water from there? We used to fetch water from there for a long time now. For a long time. Who is your father? Kicking back. And you? Your cousins. Your cousins. Yes. Your cousins. Yes. Drop those water. Come on, give them. Hey, go home right now and tell your father or whoever that sent you. But I, Mazi Bekwe, said that you will not go home with the water you fetch from my brother's house. Did you hear me? Henceforth, do not fetch water from there again. Did you hear me? If I get you fetching water there, hey! Hey! I will kill you. Nonsense! Idiot! Idiot! 
My children will not fetch water. But you ordinary people who does not know anything about my family will be fetching water. My children will be going to the stream. What? 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 Oh, Lord. What the nonsense? What the nonsense? What the nonsense? This gentleman will show you. I will show you. I will show you this gentleman. Hey! Ure mana Ah ah! What's the problem? Why are your faces like this? It's Ichi Bikwe. What happened? He broke our can. He broke your can? Yes, yes mama. mama. Why? Because he saw us coming out from your compound after flashing water. Huh? Eh? Yes, mama. Which Ibekwe? My husband's brother yes. broke your cans yes. because you came to my house to fetch water. Yes, ma'am. Oh, me, me. Oh, sir, follow me to the house. Hey! That's why you just follow my husband. Huh? Now, what happened? For what? Hey! That woman is becoming something else. What do we call that? Each gender should be very careful with me in this village. Of course. Oh, I will, I will do so. I will do something. Something like what? What will you do? Huh? I'm asking you. What will you do? Ijen, mm -hmm. has he got into the point of coming to this place and hold my clothes? A titled man. Uh, oh, please! That title will kill you. That title will kill you. Is what is your business? What is your take on what I have decided to do with my property? What? If you go, allow her to be filming her mouth. She will surely hear from us. What is your business on how I have decided to use my property? What? And do you? Are you a man? Are you one of the men in this clan? You are holding my clothes. I am holding your clothes. I just, said, are you a Just imagine. Man? I am a titled man. Oh, please! Talking. Which title? Who gave you the title? Eh? Title of Chocolate Coban Conscious. Who are you? What have you done for the community? What have you done for this clan? What have you done? Apart from impregnating widows. Watch your mouth. Oh, please! Shut up! And do you? Do you want me to tell him who has been impregnating your wife? You think I don't know why you killed your wife? Now listen. This will be the first and the last time you will disturb those girls from using the bubble. Else, what I will do to you, what I will do to you, this village, I'm not here. Hear me again. Ijendo, I respect your sons and my late brother. Else, uh -huh. I would have done something. Else, Gineme! Ibekwe, don't hear me! Ibekwe, leave her. You will hear from us. Don't worry. Oh, forget. It's okay. You threw my cap. Oh, please. I will do my You removed my get cap. Get out. Please, let's go. You this will hear from just us. a little. The next time, I will come here to give you warning about what concerns me and my property. You removed my cap from my head. Well done, your You will hear from us. Oh, thanks. Don't worry. Okay. You will hear from us. Oh, Can you see this woman? Allow her go. She will hear from us. You see what this woman has just done? It's okay to me. Take it easy. She will hear from us. No problem. You're going. You will see me. You're going to see me. Each time you will see me. Ah, Papa. Papa. This woman has done so much. If the men in this community don't do something about it, she will control this clan. I know what I'm saying, oh. I know what I am saying, Papa. Go, ma. Go in. I said, go in. This is an affair for men. And we must handle it in our own way. Go! Keep before she will handle it. Handle it, Papa! Handle it! Ibekwe, I may go diabolic on this one. All through my life, no woman has ever looked at me in the eyes and split fire. Hi. Not even my wife. Hmm. Her husband was a government contractor. He made so much money from that business. Yes. He never looked at me in the eyes and talked to me. Anyway, it didn't fit. Now, the wife talks to me anyhow. She has touched the tail of a tiger. I am going to deal with that woman. I am not going to lie on this one. It's a promise. Ezra, <laughs> this woman 
has really done the worst. And we must deal with that. What look, nonsense? Look at my cap. Ezra, look at my cap. Can you imagine? A titled man, look at my cap. Look at my cap. I can see it. So what you heard was true. So that woman has the guts to go to your father's house, hijacked him. Boy, I tie. Hmm. That woman has taken enough in this village. She has beaten more than she can chew. Yeah? Amarachi, who told you that? I can't remember discussing that with you. Was it not Chika and Orema that has been spreading the news around the whole village saying that Ijendu came to your father's house and hijacked him and Ichieze? That they couldn't even do anything, that if they had coughed, that her children would just throw them into jail. You see those two idiots? You see those two idiots? The day I will catch them, eh? What I will do to them in this village? Anyway, thank God my father controlled his temper. If not, Ichi Eze Chuku would have beaten the hell out of that woman. If she ever tries such a thing with me, I swear I will kill her. Stupid woman who denied us access to the borehole but allows outsiders to come and fetch from meat. Don't mind her. Let her go with her smelling borehole very soon. Unduka's borehole will be ready. I will be going there to fetch water the way we like. Nobody will talk to us. But wait, though. Are you sure Mama Nduka will even allow us to fetch for free? Eh, hey, now! Even if Nduka said we should pay for the ball, it's not better than going to that stream that is very far. It's better, oh. Uh -huh. It's better. What are you saying? I'll be calling your number soon and saying, not available, not available. Why? Mm, you know how it is with our light, light there now. It's always something else. My phone came up this morning. How are you? I'm blessed. How is Mama? Mama is fine. So who do you live out? Chukube, my younger sister. Chukube, your younger sister? Yes. How old is she? She's 15 and besides, Mama is better now. And there's no more pain. In her right hand. I mean, I'm just here to just say thank you. I mean, I came here just to say thank you. Please stop. Don't thank you. Me. You know, Mama Nuko would have died if not because of you. I just want to say thank you for what you've done. Thank you. May God bless you for me. Please sit. Stop this. Sit. Thank you. Mama Lu is also my grandma, okay? I'm happy she's better now, and you're happy. Thank you. <laughs> Danny, your house is so untidy. Yes, that's because I have been busy with work. Yet my elder brother will never praise me for once. <laughs> okay, that's fine. I'm just going to go inside and freshen up and clean everywhere. Before the go inside fresh air, let's go and eat outside. Uh, outside and, and do what? No. Well, then that one is it has ended. Oh. I'm just going to go inside, freshen up and go to the market and buy something for us to that is if you don't have anything in the kitchen. My kitchen is on Kent. So just freshen up, come let's go outside and eat. Okay. <laughs> 
I'll just arrange the whole house then.
I know that apart from Obina, Elendo has no other male child. That boy has the guts to come here and warn you. Hi. What is it? He's very lucky, oh. Makana Oblu no Konkwo, Oblu Mubo Konkwo. I will not spare him. I will not. Just because his father left him some millions in his bank account, mm. he sees no reason to respect an elder. Is he not old enough to know that what his mother is doing is wrong? That means he's part of our problem. Mm. <laughs> anyway, he is still a child. Sooner or later, he will realize his mistakes. All through his rants, I did not cough. I allowed him to say all sorts of things. He said so many things. Even when my daughter wanted to call him to order, he shuts her up. Enters his car and zoomed off. But <laughs> I will tell him that he's a small boy. I will tell him. Hmm. You have to. You have to, Mazi Bekwe, because these little boys do not know why most mass crates do their own things by night. They don't know. <laughs> Is he who initiated into the masculine cult? Who knows? Though I called his uh, senior brother, I told him what his mother and younger brother did. Uh -huh. He apologized on their behalf. But, <laughs> but I will, I must. Oh. 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 to pray first before you eat. Really? Mm -hmm. Lead us in prayer then. May you pray? <laughs> okay. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Bless us, O Lord, and this is your gift which we are about to receive from your goodness through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. It's okay. Mm. Nice. Who taught you how to cook? Mama Nuku taught me. Mama Nuku. Yeah, I told you I grew up under her tutelage. She must be a wonderful cook. Mm hmm. I've not eaten anything this nice in a long while. Mm hmm. What? Hmm. Okay then. Because of this, I'm going to make you ufako. Hmm? I'm going to make uba and abacha. Hmm. And you prepare all that? Yes, I can. Monica taught me all these things, you know. What? Abacha is my favorite. Hmm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh -huh. I'm, I'm good at that one. I'm very good. I know you got the right person. That means your new name is Kitchen. <laughs> my new name is Kitchen. <laughs> my, my new name is Kitchen. Your Kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> so, you banana. 
and eat it with your rice. Mm. This is the best way to eat rice with banana. Mm. <laughs> Now that Mama Nubu is fine, I was thinking. Thinking about what? Your school. You have to further your education. Yes. I don't care what it will take. Go do your clearance. Make sure you are among the next badge going for youth service. I will sponsor that. You do this for a common call girl like me. You are not a call girl. Situation led to that, okay? But thank God we met. So I've decided to support you and if possible change your life. That's your sense of money. You are not a call girl. Yeah, I was, I was actually doing a manual job just to help mama. And I abandoned my education and started selling pure water on the streets just to, to survive. All the men that I knew and sorted for help just wanted one thing from me, my body. I've never in my life been loved by any man. Everything that a man could give me I was contented with until she fell sick. And we went to everybody for help. Even our relations. And I just wanted Mama to go so they could take everything. Ooh. My grandmother had only my mother. They were very happy. Until my mother had me and my youngest sister. <laughs> when, when the diagnosis was cancer of the breast, my world just crumbled and I started selling my body for money. <laughs> it's okay. So, Danny. It's okay. so, I'm not a bad girl. I'm not. The day you and your brother picked me up at the club was the first day I stepped my leg in that club. I'm not a bad girl. It's okay. Consider all your problems solved. I mean, every word of it. From Mamanuku's breast cancer to you not having money. In fact, all your problems are hereby solved. Consider all your problems gone. Yes, I mean, every word of it. Stop crying, okay? Stop crying. No, 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 it's okay. My God bless you. All your problems are hereby solved. And God will bless you for me. Okay. God will bless you for Mama Nuku. God will bless you for everything that you've done for us. God will bless Stop you. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. God will bless you for me. It's okay. It's okay. I said 
solve your problems. <laughs> Well, um, if I really want to be sincere to my humble self, I'll mm -hmm. say the truth, which, which is, is. <laughs> it's not been easy, it's not been easy, but we thank God for everything. So, how was the sister and uh, her set of twins? Yeah, they're good. At least she can do other things now. Oh. And, uh, Husband got her a maid last week. Hmm. Good, good. So, mm. have you been missing us? What did you say? Have you been missing us? <laughs> of course, you know I will definitely miss you and my beautiful daughter. Huh? I miss you both. But, Thank you, you're back. Okay. So, did you prepare anything for me? I mean, did you cook? Yes. Let me go get your food. Oh. Sure. Good, good, good. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, I can't wait, man. Sir. Morning, my dear. How are you? You are welcome. Feeling good. How are you? I'm blessed, man. It's precious, home. Oh, she went to fetch water at the stream. She will soon be back. Okay. Uh, Emma, please. Do I know you? Not really, Mama. My name is Daniel. The guy that came through for you while you were sick. Hey, what? Daniel! You are the Daniel! Give up with Daniel! Hey! One thing, come and have a seat. Hey, whoa! It is good to have you here. Good to see you. Nah, I'm not. Huh? You're welcome. Now don't shout too much. You know you're still recovering. Why won't I shout? You did a lot for me. Eh? You paid for the hospital bills. I want you tried. My God will bless you. Over blessing, you know, everything good will come your way. You will live long and your children will look after you. You know, I pray from my heart and as I pray, so shall it be. Hi, of the God of my own. No, 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 just a few months ago. I'm happy to see Mama smiling again. <laughs> That's my Chokube, the one I told you about. Oh, Chokube. <laughs> Fine girl. Okay, let's sit down. Welcome. No, no. Go and find something for me to eat. <laughs> no, no. Oh. Thank you. Welcome. Hey. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Who is the fire sir? Oh. Daniel in the office? Not yet, sir. What about the files on uh, the flyover? He's yet to submit it, and the contractor was here this morning. Oh, 
Okay. All right, I'll, I'll call him. Okay, I'll call him, right? Let's go to your office. All right, sir. We are you know the girl Danny picked from the club? What are you doing here? So what are you doing here? Crazy! Rubbish! What are you doing here? Crazy! Rubbish! What are you doing here? So this girl is responsible! Danny, stop! So this girl is the reason why you've abandoned your job, you refuse to pick calls. What is she doing here? Can you remember? How dare you lay your filthy hands on my girl? Yes, I will! Danny, yes, I will! This girl is not good for you! We picked her from the club and I respected her with the girl, you let her go! And you! Am I a beg you? Who are you to tell me what is good for me? I, I don't care! You! I've warned you before. I don't want to see you in this house again. Yes, you had a deal with my brother. He paid you for the deal. So it is expected that you go back to where you're coming from. Leave our house, don't pollute our house. <laughs> you leave! You're fighting me, no. You're fighting me, no. You're fighting me. Stop. You're your brother. Stop. You're fighting because of this girl. Stop what? Obina, stop. She's an impending danger. You are fighting me! You are not in the position to tell me who to date. Am I telling you who to date? I am not the baby. This is my decision. Respect it. Where did you pick her from? The club? If you want a good guy, go to the church. Go to places, not to the club. What does location has to do with her life? Open now. Do you realize you had it? Open now. The meeting is... Chooks, I won't believe my brother wanted to put up a fight. My brother Daniel wanted to fight me. Tell me, what is wrong if I advise my brother to be focused? Oh, because of what Daniel doesn't know. This is becoming unbelievable. Dan wanted to put up a fight with you. Because of the girl? If I may ask you, sir, do you know this girl in person? Yes, I do. I do. And that is why I don't want that girl around my brother. I know her rendezvous with men. She hobnobs with men. I mean, different men. She doesn't have any good legacy. It comes up. I think Daniel will understand with time. You say will understand? Understand when? Jokes tell me, how old is Daniel? How old is he? 
What is the time now? Is he not supposed to be in the office? No, tell me, what's the time now? He's not in the office. When he knows we have some jobs to do, there are jobs to deliver. Uh, don't worry about that, sir. Uh, I already rescheduled the meeting with the client for Friday. And when I, when I did see you in the office, up to 10 a.m., I knew something was wrong. So I placed the call and the client brought it to it. Just be calm. Everything will be fine. You see, you see why, why you're dependable. Yes, you're one of the trusted staff here. Thank you for, for this. Thank you. I was even thinking how we we're going to handle this. You just saved me some stress now. Thank you. But it still baffles me why my brother has insisted that he wants a girl. I just want to save the details. Yes. Let's just, I'm not just happy. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Yobina. Obina. Stay away from me and my woman. You are my blood brother, yes, but that does not give you the right to choose who I date. Even if she's a dwarf, leave her for me. She's a prostitute, leave her for me. Let us be. Danny, what sagacity? Is this what you came here to tell me? Yes. Leave my woman and I alone. Else I will open the sealed bag. What kind of statement is that? You're asking me? No, you're asking me. Okay. Breaking news. Are you not... Obina. Obina! Don't make me talk too much. Nonsense. You are my other brother, fine and good, but that does not give you the right to choose who I date. What is your problem? If you see, if you disturb us again, I, I go update your wife. Try him again, I go update your wife. Danny! What impetus? What impetus? How dare you come to my house and begin to blab? In presence of my wife, when you see? Uh, uh, oh, no, sunshine. No, or, or, or sorry, it means my younger brother and sometimes on the eh? I'm sure it's one of the stands, eh? You don't want to answer my question. And I ask you again. What is going on between you and your younger brother? And I said nothing. I said, nothing is my younger brother. And nothing is going on between us. Nothing is going on between you and your brother. <laughs> and you expect me to believe you. You heard him. You just heard him talk about a sealed bag and some sort of idea you brought about. How does that affect you? How does that affect you, sunshine? Tell me. Come on. It was just a simple deal, a mad deal we carried out in the company. I cannot even explain why he was even screaming that way. Ah, a simple deal. A deal that took place in the office. That couldn't remain in the company, isn't it? And he came into this house, filming that way. How does it affect you, for <laughs> God's sake? <laughs> you were telling lies, and you know it. How does that affect you, sunshine? That my younger brother came here fuming, it's not your business. I have told you, learn how to mind your business. That my younger brother came here fuming, it's not your business. If I want you to know anything, I will tell you. Keep calm. Why you take it to your people, for God's sake? Excuse me. Why George in a book? But it's over, Mama, my brother. Don't judge someone by his look. 
in a situation Make her a fish man Your choice is not my choice If I have a so so how long are you going to be like this? Please hold yourself together. Eh? Look, let me tell you. If you are so important to Daniel, he will surely come looking for you. Yes. Stop killing yourself over this. Look, that young man is a very nice person. I am very, very sure he will not allow you go like that. You know? Mama, Daniel is not the problem. His elder brother is. I don't know why he hates me so much. Then that is what you will ask Daniel when he comes. Try and find answer to your question. You know? And let me tell you, in a situation like this, you have to be prayerful. Pray to God. Pray for God's intervention. He will do it his own way. You know? Stop crying. It's okay. What really happened? Because I have been trying to see you for a very long time. Because of this arthritis on my legs, it makes it difficult for me to walk hey. most of the time. Hey. Ndo. Thank you. Ndo. Your son started building a borehole for us. Okay. All of a sudden, work stopped. What really happened? Uh, no, not, nothing. There's no problem. No problem. And there's no cause for alarm. Mm? Just that one of the engines had a knock. And but we we'll sent for another one, but it has yet to come. Hmm? Hmm. But for the water, the work has gone very, very far. Very far. <laughs> have they come in contact with the water? I mean, uh, have they seen the water yet? Um, not yet, but very close. Very, very close. close. Mm. Yes. Don't worry about that. That shouldn't bother anybody. I know my son. As long as he has paid for it, the work must be done. My happiness is that very soon the villagers will be happy again. Of course. And shame <laughs> will be put on Ijendu. Finally. <laughs> Were you not told she came to Ibikwe's house and disgraced both of us? Didn't he? She held on to our clothes. I was dragging us like hey! children. Didn't anyone tell you? Mama, nobody told me. You know, I just, I just came back from my daughter's house in Lagos. Nobody told me. Wait, wait. You mean Ijendu came to Ibiqui's house to do what? It's not a small thing. She said there is no man, man enough from our clan. No. I am going to deal with that woman. She will hear from her shrine. I promise her that. Hey! Honestly, no, no, no. See, see this woman has beaten more than she can chew. This is getting too much now. It's getting too far. Something must be done. I'm telling you. I will ah! with her. Well, let me go and see Bikwe. At least let me understand this whole thing. This, this, I, I, can't, I can't put my head to this thing. I can't wrap myself around this whole thing. Why? It's all right. It's, I'll, I'll see you later. Eh? I'll Do see so. you later. It's okay. Please just take care of your leg. Eh? It's all right. Take care. <laughs> Everything you see. Sister, your phone has been ringing. Okay, thank you. How is Mama? She's inside, she's lying down. Has she eaten? Yes, yeah, she has eaten. But follow your heart. So the world begins. You can never be misled by your heart. Only your heart will tell you the truth. Hello? Good morning, Danny. She's an angel, beautiful. Lord. Okay. She's wife material. Don't just her away. She's an angel, beautiful. Lord. The woman has been looking and asking about you. 
What for? To be sure you are aware that Rosemary is not pregnant for me at all. She just wants to gossip my name. A holy boy like me. She just wants to gossip with my name. That's all. Biaikena, how are you sure that she's not pregnant for you? For how many months now? Eh? Did you see her stomach pull out? Did you? A pregnant woman will be visible at her fourth month. So she's not. Eh? And anytime she sees me, she will run away. Why are you telling me this? I mean, what is my business? You said we couldn't date and be friends because she's pregnant for me. So I am here reminding you that she's not pregnant. Is that all? That's all, Lou. Okay. As you can see, I'm carrying firewood. And I'm tired. So let me go home and rest. Okay. Can I help and take the firewood to your house? No. No, you cannot help me. Leave me alone, Ikenna. Leave me alone. Ah ah. Ugoma. Ugoma, stop all this thing now. Is it a crime to love you? Okay, eh? <laughs> me. I, I never knew all this happened while I was at my daughter's house. Is it you could just told me? Eh? That was what we saw. Hey! But I have forgotten all about that. The bow hole is in her house, so why should I go dragging it? <sighs> her younger son came to this place, shouting down and supporting his mother. Eh? Of course, yes. Hey! Huh. Huh. So, so this is all what Ijendu wants. This is just what she wants. You have seen it. Ha! Ah, you have seen it. But my prayer is that gods of our land will continue to bless and enrich your son. Yes, so that he will complete the project of the bowhole he is having for us. He said, God will continue to enrich him. He said, and that is how it must be. He said, and also our sons, your son too. <laughs> you, 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 you see, that is the advantage of marrying on time. You can see, your that, that, son, as small as the young boy is, he is having such a huge project it's, it's, for the community. It's God. It's not my doing, it's just mm -hmm. destiny. It's God. Mm. It's God. So, how is the project going? Um, it's going well, going very well. Uh, I, just like I told Izzy, mm. the engine has got spoiled. Oh. Uh, but, but we are expecting a new one by next week. Okay. Then after that, mm. water will be found. Wait, wait a minute. Ozubu, Ozubu. Do you mean after next week, uh -huh. we'll have water? Bam. In Bonkom? Bam. To drink? Hell! Not <laughs> Ijendo's water? Not Ijendo's water! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Gods of our land, you are not sleeping at all. Uh -huh. You really mean it? I'm telling you. Oh. Finally, each Hindu will be put to shame. In this land, mm -hmm. she must go down. We will see her go down. Yes, uh, Chooks. So, how far have you gone with the, the speed? They're saying what? 4.5 million. So what was your bargain? I said, what was your bargain? Four. Fair deal. Fair deal. Fair deal. It's a fair deal. It's a fair deal. It's a fair deal. Just, just insist. Oh, let me call you back. Ah. <laughs> How are you? Sunshine. How are you? Mm. Baby. Very well, very well. Hello, how are you? Are you sure you're fine? <laughs> you didn't go to the office? No, 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 maybe later. later. Okay. Mm. Anyway, you think I have to change your school? Change your school? Why? Because her performance these days is so poor. Sandra? Yes, Daddy. You heard what your mother said. He said uh, your performance is low. Is it true? Yes. Why? My teacher doesn't teach me anything. Of course, the child oh, was right. Oh, 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 oh. I went through her books mm -hmm. and what I saw, 
wasn't encouraging. encouraging. So I just made up my mind mm. to take her for an extra moral classes. I just brought her back now from the lesson. Okay. Mm. At least from there she's picking up a bit, but I ah uh, no no no. She's not going back there. Spending that so much amount of money mm. yet she can't yes, pick yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Right, you're right. How about? Sandra, you had your mommy? Yes. Okay. You want me to change you, I mean, take you to a new school? Yes. Really? Yes. Hope that will make you improve more. Yes. It's all right. <laughs> all right, consider it done, sunshine. Of course. Yeah, the thing it. there is this. Mm. I've got bills to pay. Bills? Yes. <laughs> I'm equal to the task. All right. Don't worry. Hmm? <laughs> oh, let's go inside. See you. Anything for my. Oh, come on, Sandra. Don't give daddy a peck. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, join your mommy, okay? I join you soon. <laughs> Educational system in this country is so bad now. You pay much, you get less. Gone comatose. I want you to take this as a challenge. Not an insult. I mean, my brother could be your elder brother. And he sees you as a core girl that we picked up for one night stand. He doesn't know the real you. So please, forget about my elder brother. I will sort all that, okay? Fine, no problem. Fine. I've forgiven him. But, you know. I can't come to your house anymore. I'm that, sorry. That means you don't want to see me again. How can you stop coming to my house because of my other brother? No, that's wrong. It doesn't make sense, okay? I mean, I don't want to come in between brothers. You are not coming in between brothers. Trust me, I will fix this. Let my brothers shout some drama or get to you, okay? Please. Okay? Have you heard me? Hmm. Okay. Good. Thanks. So when are you leaving for camp? I took Sunday. They said we should be there on Sunday. Okay. So I hope um what of my mom Nugu and um their little sis. Hope they have what will sustain them while you are not around. Yes, they do, but I'll get them more before I leave. Okay. I will transfer 400,000 Naira for you. Now, you use 100,000 to buy food stuff and drop for them. Drop 100,000 Naira cash in case you want to buy something. Then keep the 200 for yourself. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> That's the smile I've been looking for. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank You're you. welcome. I must confess, this food is delicious. If only joy is half as good as this, I won't be eating outside. But joy is a bad cook. I won't you bother to ask why I don't eat in your house? I know, Danny. I know. And honestly, eh? if you know the Ngwongwo, she serves me as food. You pity your brother. Yes. I have a. Uh, sometimes I just feel she cooks because she's a wife and she has to fulfill that responsible obligation as a wife. Because if she tastes what she gives me, she won't give me. Why do you say so? Because her food is tasteless now. Her food is tasteless. I have begged her to learn. But she thinks I'm joking. As I talk to you now, I, I no longer eat in my, in my house. Serious? I no longer eat. Let me not bore you with that story. This food is delicious. Who did you say prepared it? She must be a fantastic cook. Yes, no doubt. This food was 
prepared by someone you've met. Really? Yeah, she comes here most weekends, mm. prepare different dishes, and put them in my fridge. I hardly eat out these days, bro. Who would eat out with this kind of food? So who is this person you're talking about? Say that name. Her name is Ihuoma. Precious. You eat copper. Ihuoma is her Igbo name. She's the one that prepared this food. Kidding me? Danny, you are kidding me? You mean you still went back to that slot? What is this now, Danny? Oh, you bought the lie she told you that she's a serving call member. No, now that girl is a slut, Danny! Keep away from that girl! How do you allow her come to her to cook? Can you calm down and understand your brother? Relax. There is nothing to understand. How can you be playing around with, with a slut and you tell me to understand? How? This is crazy! <laughs> That's serious. Open that she's not a slut. Stop. Danny. Danny, have you forgotten what I told you about our family? I mean, my wife and pregnancy. How we need a son who will take over from us. Danny, what's going on? How can you allow that cheap slut to sell that lies to you? I mean, you said you've been hobnobbing with that girl, a girl who sleeps around with every man. Come on, you can do better. Danny, you can do better. I am highly disappointed in you. If you had told me from the beginning it was this guy who prepared this food, I won't eat it. Come back, I will go home. Obina. Don't open me. I'm highly disappointed in you. I can't stand here anymore. Obina, never judge a book by its cover. There is no book to judge. This book is already in the public domain. Everybody has read the book. There is nothing you tell me. Excuse me. She's not that bad, bro. Precious is not whom you think she is. Relax. Danny. What is Danny still doing with that girl? How could he be keeping a cockroach in his house? After everything I told him. He called my bluff. Because of that girl? How? What is in that girl? He even had the impetus to allow her cook in his house and I ate. Danny. Danny, you are biting more than you can chew. Nothing, I'm fine. You are not fine. I mean, from the look of your face, it's obvious you are not. Uh, same problem with your brother? Did I tell you I'm having issues with my brother? Did I? Yes. Because the sealed bag is still sealed. I wonder where you are even coming back from. Squeezing your face, even to your own child. Joy. Joy, I have warned you to stop prognosing on the affairs of I am a younger brother. You are my wife, yes. But you are not a member of the Lendus family. Says who? Your father just said so. Oh, oh. you're planning on getting... Yo, wait, wait, wait. I don't understand. Are you planning on getting married to another woman? Simply because I'm having issues giving you other children? Okay. Thank God you said this yourself. But guess what? Just pray hard. Pray I never get to find out or hear what is hidden inside that sealed bag of yours. Pray hard. Pray I never find out. Sandra, come, let's go. Get your hands off my daughter! Really? Yes! Just pray hard! Obina, pray hard! 
I never get to find out what is it in that you're crazy, dirty, silk bag! Blood! Good morning, sir. Good morning, Chuma. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Why are you doing the cleaning? What about the janitor? Sir, she took her child to the hospital. She couldn't use the Oh, the child to the hospital? Is that why you're doing her job for her? Nobody would have done this for her, sir. My child is very ill, so I decided to do it. Okay, when you. When you're done, tell Chooks to see me immediately. Oh, that's good, that's good. Tell him to see me immediately. Chooks, do you know my brother is still hobnobbing with that girl? It's a lie. That cannot be truth. I'm not kidding. As I speak, that girl has become a serious date for my brother. He gives her all the time. Even allows her to come to the house and cook for him. I'm beginning to think she uses Juju and my brother. Ah, Juju Kwa. How? I mean, how, do I, how, how would I describe this? A girl we picked from the club, paid her, now is attending youth service. <laughs> I, I am still baffled. That was what that idiot opened his mouth to tell me. A prostitute attending youth service. But where does that happen? Oh, I am beginning to understand the point. Yes, actually, girls who want to be useful to themselves yet lack capacity financially and sponsorship. All they do these days is just to devise other means, get themselves trained in school, graduate, and life goes on. At least I have seen some of them. This one is a complete liar with a certificate. Well, um, sir. I wouldn't allow you to spend so much time and attention on this darkness issue. Why we forget why we are here in the office? As for me, Daniel is a matured man. He should be allowed to take his own decisions. If he says he wants to marry that girl, let him be. At the end of the day, he will advise himself. Let him hold on to his responsibility. That's what I see. That's what I think. Not my brother. Chooks, not my brother. I mean, that girl is not welcome to my family. God, she would never be part of my family. I mean, how can my brother make a prostitute a wife? How? There are many girls everywhere, trained and disciplined girls. If he wants to pick a wife, he will go get any of these girls and make them his wife. What about Choma Bissetri? Doesn't he look at Choma? Choma is mannered, educated, and a wife material, if you ask me. <laughs> so, sorry. Uh, the secretary, Daniel cannot see the secretary because his eyes are somewhere else. He is a man. He knows what he wants for himself. Let Daniel be. Allow him make his choice. Please. 
Uh, well, uh, let me quickly catch up with the job at the roundabout and get them supervised. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I want you to do something for, for me. Effect a 10% increment for Chioma, the secretary. She's a very good woman and I think she deserves it. Just like that, sir? Shh. Don't question my decision. Let's carry out instruction to the letter. This is noted, sir. I beg to take my leave. It's okay. The idiot that has refused to come and see his mother. I thought he was busy at the office. I never knew it was the lady who has been holding him down. And as for that girl, Tonda, Tonda Siekeni Boga Bajie Koka. And you, you, Obina, that took your younger brother to a hotel. What was in your mind? Eh? Have you ever seen your father, your late father, with any woman all through his life? Have you? Mama. Mama, as men who we were bored, what do they do? Nah, let's go and unwind. And you know this kind of unwinding that you want to see people around, you want to hear noises? That was the intention. Nothing else. Oh, you are speaking grammar. In a solo more you were bored. And you went to unwind. Where wine is that your complaint? Really? I don't know why men will not keep their followers in one place. Your wife went to Omogo. As soon as she left for the Omogo, come, you jumped out of the house. Now say the story. Look at it! No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry from the depth of my heart. I'm sorry. But you see, like I said, just to unwind, free the head. That was all. And I don't know where he's taking this whole thing to. I don't know. We, we, we all did this thing now. If you, you go your way, you go your way. And he's taking it. I don't know where he's taking it to. Mama, please. I want you to wait in. I want you to talk to him. He has to behave himself. You want me to wade in into this issue that you created? Obina. Now listen. You see this, you're sorry. I need you to take it back to your wife. I don't need it. I don't know what is wrong with men. Eh? Unana wogale. Pium, 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 pium. And as for Daniel, I will know whether that house he's living in belongs to my husband or him. Kamalebogu Foundation. You went to wine. I don't remember when my late husband was alive. Anytime he wants to unwind, we unwind inside the house with television and popcorn and we produce our ice creams. But you left the house with your brother to unwind with Omo Shokolo Kobangon shows. Well, Omo Wine and I borrow call. I'm sorry, Mama. I'm sorry. Please talk to him. He's taking it too far. And if not nipped in the board now, he could. It, it will drag the name of this family to the mud. You should have thought of that in the first place before taking your younger brother to a brothel because I believe it's a brothel, it's not a good hotel. You don't see petty girls in good hotels. I've traveled. I know what it takes to see a hawk. Why are you complaining? A fizzle. Onyanele. When you order the container, 
you will have to sell it off. My friend, when you are done, if you want to go, tell me, let me pack the sorry inside the bag and uh, extend my greetings to your wife with the sorry. I'm going to find the bill here, bro. Amarachi. This one you are smiling. I hope all is well. My sister, I want to inform you that I'll be going to Lagos tomorrow. What happened? I have useless my life here. My mates are out there making ends meet. And I'm here wasting my youthful life. Rose that has been parading that she's pregnant. <laughs> It's not even pregnant. Now all the village girls are seeing me as a whack. So I need to go away for some time. At least if I come back, I will gain some respect. I'm happy for your decision, my brother. Is this not what I've been telling you about? A young man does not while away his useful time. Because as time goes by, so our age adds up. Eh? At least you like a trade. When you get there, you will see someone that will help you. Okay? So, where do you want to stay in this Lagos? I called a few of my friends and I explained everything to them. So, they said I should come. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Just go. Hmm? When you settle, I will sell that portion of land and I will send you some money. I was the one that asked Uncle Okonkwa not to sell it because then, you are not organized. But che? now that I've seen the repentance in you, don't worry, I'll sell it. Che? Chelo, you are the one that told Uncle Okonkwa not to allow me to sell that land. Hey! Okay. Well, I'm happy to hear what you said. Thank you so much. And. I'm so sorry for the headache I've caused you. It's okay. At least, Rose made all the girls in this village to reject you, believing that you got her pregnant. If not, you don't have thought of your life and this repentance in you. You're right. <laughs> so don't worry, don't see her as an enemy, but as a friend who wants your best. Okay? <laughs> uh... <laughs> I'm so happy for your decision, my brother. Oh, it's um, okay. <laughs> but I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. Okay, so come and help me. Let me pack my things, okay? It's okay, my brother. You know, first thing in the morning, I'm off to Lagos. First boss. I'll hmm? miss you. Let's take this down very well. <coughs> I can't thank God enough for making my dreams come true. Hmm? I will forever remain indebted to him for keeping me alive to see my grandchild in this uniform. Hi. Ne. You are welcome once again. Mama. How are you doing? Hmm? <laughs> How are you? I'm fine as you can see, Ne. I'm fine. <laughs> I've been waiting for you to come back so you take me to the hospital for my checkup. Fine. Sharp, sharp. You go. <laughs> oh, Mama, how have you been feeling with me? Mm, nothing really, nothing. I'm good, I'm okay. Mm? But we must do as the doctor instructed us. I will go tomorrow, okay? Mm -hmm. Nebe, <laughs> how are you? Sister, I'm fine. Thank God you are here. I really missed you. <laughs> I'm here now, okay? I'm Enjoy here. Enjoy your huh. Mama. <laughs> okay. I mean, I cannot deny this one now. This is real steady. Yeah. I know you are right. Yeah. Hmm. 
Mm-mm. 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 It's very nice though. Mm-mm. Why are you going to say it? No, I just said it. Mm -hmm. You can roast! I'm your food! She's the girl. This is the corporate who wants to ruin my brother's life. She's the one. Are you serious? So you went to report me? I didn't report you. I want to save your life. I want to save your life, Danny. Obina, you went to report me. No. Obina. Daniel. No. So, this is what you want to pay your mother with. For everything I have done for you. Hmm? So this is what you learned from your father and me. Oh, please calm down. Let's talk. I should calm down. Let's talk. Talk about what? Talk about this whore that has taking your sense of reasoning away. Now listen, I don't want to know who you are or what you do for a living. I don't want to be harsh on you unless you push me. You see this nonsense, friendship, dating, or stupid love you have with my son will not work. Because I do not want you in my family. You are not welcomed. Mama, stop calling her names. She is not a core girl. Can't you see? Look at her uniform. Okay. <clears throat> copper. Copper. You're a copper. I said it. A slot in copper's uniform. So this is your new trend. Eh? You now go on copper's uniform to confuse people. Mom, mom, please stop calling my woman names. Your woman? She's a graduate, she's a copper, she's not a slut. Please. Mom, 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 I will disown you as my mother. Huh? If you touch my woman, Mama. I will disown you as my mother. Mm -hmm. Stop! Mama, you, can you can see. Daniel, I could want him handcuffs. Okay, you know. Who will you Fighting with my mother. Daniel, I could want him handcuffs. She is my choice. You yeah. people should respect that. Hey! You, you Mama, 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 Mama
She must go. Obinna. Don't call my name. Obinna. I am serving you. Obinna. She's not your class. She's not my class, right? Yes. She's my choice. Huh? Danny! crying all by yourself or should I go and call mama no please I'm fine you know I, I just remembered something that's what I'm crying sister please don't remember that again okay let's go inside don't worry I'm coming okay sister are you okay fine. Hmm? I don't actually know if I can get a new one. Don't worry. I will explain everything to you when we see. No, no, I haven't reported. But I'm going to do that this week. Okay, please just... Just send me your account number so I can send you money to buy me a new one. Thank you. <laughs> That's what happened to my wife is so. I've never been humiliated in my life. That tiger of a woman beats me. Ha! I've got no problem. It is well. It's okay. Are you sure that guy loves you? I mean, he should have protected you. Because he did. I mean, you want him to fight his mother? <sighs> see, eh? I think I'm just going to leave him. Because you see this thing? It's getting too much. You said his elder brother beat you up once. <laughs> hmm. The guy decorated my face with slaps. And now his mother. <laughs> no. How did you even meet this guy that the family wants to kill you? Isn't that the one that asked you out? Well, we met at the supermarket and he asked me out. But now I'm confused. I'm confused about his family. I don't understand. Precious. Do you love this guy? I do. Then stick with him. <laughs> Is it not the one calling? Is it the one calling? It's the one calling. Oh please, I've been heartbroken. I can't take this anymore. It's too much. It is just too much. Oh, I don't think I can let Daniel and his, and his family kill me. 
for nothing. I just can't. Precious, follow the one you love. Hmm? It's going to take time, I know. But it will still calm down. If you actually feel anything for this guy, you have to defend it. I know it's going to be tougher, tougher than this, but you still win. Yeah? All you have to do is pray about it. Hmm? Just speak his call. He hasn't done anything to you. And I believe he loves you, that's why he's calling. Just take his call. Hmm? I'm talking to you. So the world you can never be misled by your heart, only your heart We tell you the truth. You have seen she's a wife material. She's a It wasn't my fault. I've been looking for you. I'm just coming from your school and your school teacher said you left a few minutes ago. Precious, you've not been taking my calls. Ogin is it? Are you Daniel? Yes, I'm Daniel. She's heartbroken. We just talked about you, your mom, your brother. She's confused, and, but she said it's not your fault. I'm sorry, okay? I'm ready to make amends. Please. It was never his fault at all. I am worthless, that's why you couldn't fight your brothers and your, and, and, and your mother. What happened? Oh, no, no, please. You are worth it. Don't say that, okay? Trust me, you are worth more than gold. Sorry, sir, you guys should go and settle somewhere. Please. But please, I want to beg you something. Mind her heart because she loves you. My friend loves you very much. And if your family tries to kill her, leave her alone. Thank you, Zayla. Not just for you, okay? Alright, okay. I'm sorry, okay? Please, I'm sorry. I'm ready to right my wrong. Please, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. And walk up and leave the house. What happened? Are you seriously asking me that? How am I supposed to know? The way you hear, and I saw me here too. I also heard that the children have not come to see their mother. That might be poison. Her legs are seriously decaying under one week. But who could have done such a thing to her? Are you seriously asking that question, Amarachi? Ijendu has a lot of enemies in this community. So let her suffer and die for it. Stop saying that. Remember she's a big auntie. Big auntie Buago no there. What kind of nonsense big auntie is she? Big auntie that refused us to, to, to fetch water from her bottle? Big auntie that broke my, 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 my gallon? Please don't say that again, no. Let her children come back and take their mother to the hospital. I'm going somewhere. That kind of a thing is not what they take one to the hospital. I think Edibe will handle it. It is none of my business, ooh! Amarachi! It is none of my business! It's okay. It's okay. Leave me alone. Bye! So, so what happened to her? Because I personally went to her house this morning. Her legs were something else. Honestly. She couldn't stand. I even helped her to get a cup of drinking water. You had the girls to lend a happy hand to that wicked woman? She should send for those she gave the boho to. That miserable woman had the guts to lay hold of my clothes and pushed me around like a little boy. So, you went to your shrine like you threatened? I don't know what you are talking about. Every evil doer must pay for whatever sins he or she sows. I don't know what you people are talking about, but 
that woman should die. Yeah. Yes. Let her die. She's a wicked soul. I was about sending my daughter to go and check on her and give her food since she stays at the place. Send her and see if she will obey you. The girl, she broke her gallon of water and suffered to be going to the stream to get water. That woman is wicked. Read my lips. If she dies, I assure you, no one will pay her a condolence visit. She's wicked and she's evil. Listen to me. Come on, sunshine. I'm not asking for too much. Just a few days with my mother. It won't kill you. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> Obina, you want joy, eh? To go stay with your sick mother in the village. Just a few days. You mean me, Joy? I should lock up my shop and go stay in the village. I won't do it. Yes, I won't. I mean, for what reason? Why am I doing it? For the so much love your mother expresses to me. Wait, when last did she visit this house since we got married? Sunshine, it's my mother we're talking about here. And you're sounding like she's a stranger. Does it change anything? Does it change anything? I know it's your mother we're talking about here. But I can't do it. I won't. I should carry my daughter to go and stay with your mother in the village, eh? Probably she's seated in one position. Passing urine and feces. Oh God, I should go and become her nanny. Ah, no! You had better call Danny on phone. Oh. Call Daniel. Hmm? Call him and let him know the situation on ground. He should go take care of his mother. I won't do it. I am never doing it. Come on. Sunshine. Danny is a man. Yes. Jobs like these are better done by women. I mean, women do these jobs perfectly well. This is your mother-in-law you're talking about here. Please. Hey, a mother-in-law that doesn't like her son's wife. Coupled with the fact that I couldn't give her the so-called over-expected Mason. I'll be made child. I beg. I can't do it. You see this? In fact, there's no point. There's no point in backing on this dangerous mission. Okay? It's too side for me. It's a no. I'm not doing it. Sunshine, please. <laughs> Come on. Sunshine. 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 <sighs> oh, man. Ugo, ma. Ugo? Papa. Papa, you're welcome. Uh, my daughter. Uh, did you take the food to Ijen, No, Papa. Why? But I asked you to take food to her. Papa, it is better I leave this house than taking food to that wicked woman. A woman who stopped her sons from helping us. A woman who dragged the family land with you. A woman who broke my gallon of water and spilled it on the floor instead of me using the water. That is the same woman you want me to take food to. Never, Papa. It will not happen. The other day, her son Daniel came here and threatened me. Let him go and take care of his mother. After all, my own mother is dead. Huh. My daughter, 
you do not pay evil with evil. Despite all she did, her son Obina has been good. So we can be good because of him. So please, she is in need of someone. Do your own and allow the creator to judge. Mba! Papa, I say no, I will not. I will not take food to her. I will not. Ah, what is it now, Papa? Will you force me? Let me advise you as my father. Please stop going to that house before she will start telling people that you poisoned her leg. And there's a way you, you will force me. I will just put poison in the food and give to her. Is it what? Yes, Papa, I will. So it is better she dies of hunger than, than die, dying of my poison. No? Choose one. Look at mine. Look at what I care. Imagine this girl. Hey! But Ijendo caused her problem. She has never been a good woman. You can see how these children are, are abandoning her anyhow. I thought you said you engaged the services of a herbalist. Yet, no improvement. I suggest we take mom to a good hospital. Hospital? Do hospitals cure cases like this? No, they don't. However, the man promised that Mama should be getting, I mean, better gradually. That her recovery will be coming gradually, gradually. Okay, let's take her to your house so that your wife can take good care of her. Mama needs someone. Hey! Joy! I don't need joy. I'd rather die here. Please. She will turn my remaining joy to sorrow because I don't need her. Hey! What's going on? She hates me. Mama, you will not die. Okay. She doesn't want your wife. And your wife says she's not coming down here either. So what do you suggest we do? Well, uh, Danny, let me correct an impression. Mama, my wife doesn't hate you. She loves you as a mother-in-law. So please, try and just keep aside that feeling you have that my wife hates you. She doesn't. Okay. Uh, and Danny, you, you can try your own angle. Hmm? Explore your angle. I will talk to a few people. Hmm. So I don't even know what to think. Maybe we should get someone we can pay. That would not be a bad idea. I'm saying she doesn't want my wife. Biko, get someone you want. Get someone, Biko. Get someone. I don't need joy. Get someone. Oh, yeah. Mother, I'm not Ah. What's up? Ah, get him. Look, there you are. How are you? Fine. Your mother? Uh, I was here yesterday and I was told you didn't come. Are you the herbalist? Hmm? Allow me to do my job. I told you that she needs someone who will be there for her to take care of her and prepare the medicine for her. That woman is passing through a lot. But the legs are not getting any better. Bina, don't worry. She will be fine. This is poison. Don't expect miracle. Gradually, it will heal. Okay? It's okay. Let me check on her. Okay? It's okay. Um, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. So, how are you today? I feel pains. I feel pains inside my bones. I was unable to sleep all through the night. I see him on 
Please, may I know who did this to me? Mama, that is not important. The most important thing is for you to get well and stand on your feet again. No who is responsible will cause a lot of harm than good. So please, forget about that. Get well first. So someone has the mind to come put poison around my house. Easy. Can I ask you a question? Are you that wicked that all the herbalists around this vicinity did not agree that thing to you? It's not their business. It's because you are not fair to them. Amend your ways. This life is a passage. See, whatever good you want to do for people, do it when you are alive. You know, I move around and I ask questions. I come to realize that you refuse people access to the bow who your husband dug for them. Even your face some big you and you refused. Maybe the angry one amongst them did this to you. Instead of them to appease me and see if I can agree them fetch water. Eh? They poisoned my two legs. <laughs> Here is my maternal home. I know my way around this village. I had a lot of things. Please, I beg you, make peace with everybody. Open your heart. Wabo from here. Please. Your mother is from this village. You know your way around. You heard stories. Have you asked me why? We have my partner dead in the family. But I believe what a woman. Can I get Can I I'm wasting much time. Have this. Mix it with a bottle of snap. Okay. Next to it, for men's work. She'll be taking it morning and night. Mm. That will help to straighten her bones. Okay. She'll be fine. That's my assurance to you. Thank you very much. You're Thank welcome. you so very much. So, do you need any money? Not yet. I want her to get healed first. Okay? I will be on my way. Huh? I don't know. Is it go? Hey, I'll see you. I'll see you. I'll see you. So this that's the reason why she is not here to tear my clothes again. Ah? Huh? And then if I need to leave before your brother comes back. As per what? What are you saying? I will not. Do you know how I escaped from her the last time? If I had not run away, your mother would have killed me. She would have killed me, Danny. I was 
actually naked. That was not fair. My mom is a bad person, no doubt. If I have the chance to choose a mom, I will definitely not pick her. But please, you need to do this for me. As we speak, my mom is down. She is in pain. She can't even walk. She might not even recognize you when you get there. Please. I know she treated you bad. But at the same time, she's my mom. I can't just sit back, fold my arms and watch my mom die because she's a bad person. No. She is still my mom. No. Please. Danny. Danny. I can do any, anything for you. Anything. But you see this one? This one is not part of that. Your mother will kill me if she sees me. You don't get it. She can't even walk. She might not even recognize you when you get there. You're doing this for me. Even in my village, many hate my mom because of her bad character. But she's still my mom. I can't watch her die. Please do this for me. She's seriously down. She can't even walk. Please. Can you stop me? Please. No. Please. I said no. I said please. I said no. Please. No. No. She's wife material. She's an angel. Beautiful love. She's wife material. What kind of story is that? She's an angel. Beautiful love. She's an angel. She's wife material. I'm a judge with what to see. She's an angel. With what to see. Um, precious. To be honest with you. Danny has done a lot for you. He took care of your grandmother who almost died. Paid for our operation and still spent money on her medication till date. Listen, his mother might not be a good woman, which he said in front of me. He said it before me, yes. But I advise you as a friend, hmm? take permission from the principal. Go and look after the woman and leave. He didn't ask you to leave with her. <laughs> Seriously, Fama. This is going to be big and the hardest thing for me to do. <laughs> no. Okay, what if she sees me and starts yelling? Oh. And starts yelling my clothes. Oh, wait, come on. What even if she again? Even if she would do that. Not now that she needs help now. Eh? See, babe, that woman doesn't have a female child. And Danny is the last. So taking care of his mom falls on his shoulders. Okay, see what will happen, babe. I'll be coming time to time to see you. How do you see that? Hmm? Ah, from a see. This woman acted to me like a tigress. And the fear is still inside of me, and I don't think I can go. Baby, you're not doing what she did. You are not doing this for this woman. You are not no. even doing it for Danny. You are doing this for God. I'm not going. Eh? I'm not going. Baby, you have to. Just try now. No. Eh? I need my piece. I'm not going. Ha! Fresh. I'm not going. Rosemary. Rosemary! Why did you do those things? You literally made every woman in this community see him as a womanizer. Who goes around impregnating women? Why? Ogoma, the truth is that I, I saw the fire in his eyes. And you and I know that Ikenna is very intelligent. So I didn't want him to stay in this village and while away his time. You know, my mother told us such stories, so I used it on him and it worked. Huh. You and one. You that rejected his friendship request, placing the rejection for him to come and marry me. Yet. He didn't do anything. Do you know you're very lucky? You are very lucky that it was Ike now you tried that rubbish with. If it were to be other guys, eh? They would have kicked you front and back. By now, you see this your shape. It just, your shape will look somehow. You are still running your mouth. <laughs> Seriously. He will see me and shout, call me all sorts of names. It was only one so that he tried to strangle me. That day I was so afraid, but he's really a gentleman. Hmm. 
I also added to his frustration now. Anytime I see him on the way, I will tell him, go and marry Rosemary. She's pregnant for you. Go and marry Rosemary. She's pregnant for you. I'm telling you the truth. Hey! She's oh, like, okay, nah. Have you heard from him? Like, since he traveled, have you heard from him? No, I've mm -hmm. not. Though I saw the sister yesterday, and she said he asked about me. Oh no. I pray he will succeed and be a better person. Yes, he will succeed. He will come back with so much money so that he can impregnate you for real. Mm. You know he asked you out, right? So maybe he's going to come for you. <laughs> Go mad the fight girl. Okay. He's going to come get me. Ikena's money. wife. Ikena's wife. Ikena's wife. Okay, you're talking Ikena's about yourself. Wife. You, Ikena's wife. Mama, good day. You're here. What is this? My dear. This is what I have been suffering from. This is what I have been suffering. But God will heal my legs. Daniel, who is she? Mama? Mama? I brought her here to take care of you. Her name is Ihuoma, aka Precious. Have I met her before? Yes. I know you. She's the one I chased out of your house. Then you brought her here to come and laugh at me. Mama, she's the one you chased out of my house. Yes. But she's not here to laugh at you. I brought her here to take care of you because you need someone around you. To take care of me? Yes, she has a few weeks leave from where she's teaching. So I begged her to come help me take care of you. She, she agreed to come and take care of me. I am a Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry. My dear. Good morning. In case you want to buy anything, we have shops here. The market is not even far from this place. Yeah, and I'll always be coming from time to time to see you. No problem. Thank you very no much. Let me show you your room. Okay. Oh, we're coming. No, no, no. Hey, Daniel, do I tell you this? Ah! Oh, mother, believe. Why, George, in a book? I'm back, it's over. Mama, my brother, don't judge someone by his look. Now, situation. <laughs> Young lady. Good morning, sir. Good morning to you, my daughter. Are you part of the family? No, sir. I'm just I'm just happy mama. Ah. And you are washing and cleaning the whole compound. <laughs> I have to clean the dirty compound and wash the dirty clothes too. It's a bone one. That's good of you. <laughs> um, if I forget them. Have this. Cut it into two. Hmm? Mix with water. 
in a small rubber can or this bottle of water and bring it to me. Let me see. Be careful who you trust. My catching in a beautiful. But follow your heart. So the world begins. You can never be misled. So, how are you feeling today? I feel better. Mm. At least the pain is not deep again. I slept well last night. And because mm, I told you, it will heal gradually. By the way, I saw one young woman outside the compound, washing all the clothes. Who is she? You mean she's washing my clothes? Mm. We step outside. You see her washing all the clothes. Let's ask again. Who is she? She's my son's friend. My son brought her to take care of me. Hmm. Hmm. I saw a wife. I saw a virtuous woman. I saw someone that is brought up with humility. Such characters are in these days. I must tell you. Okay. You see this, huh? This will help to shrink the bad blood. Okay? Please rub it on her morning and night before she sleeps. Don't allow water to touch it. Do you understand? Rub it. And this. <clears throat> Have it. This is bitter. She may not like to drink it. But make sure she takes it half cup every morning before she eats. Do you understand? I will be here next two market days to check on her. Please take good care of her. Alright. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, oh. Mm. Mama. Mm. I have not eaten anything today. What am I going to make for you? The DP has told me that you washed all my dirty clothes. Even the ones I urinated on. And I heard when you were singing and sweeping the compound this morning. Am I right? Mama, please, what are you going to eat? You know, when you've not answered my question, is this the kind of person you are? Well, I mean, the compound was dirty, so I needed to clean it. And at least you cannot start sweeping at your age and in this condition. Mama, please, what am I going to cook for you to eat? I said you came here to take care of me. So decide what I will eat. In fact, from now on, you decide what will happen. Okay, that's fine. So, I guess I'll make tea for you now and make jello fries for you in the afternoon. Anything you need is in that kitchen. Why 
Is she trying to impress me or what? She took my heap of clothes, washed, and swept the whole compound. Of course, she knew I wouldn't stand up to see it and applaud her. Yet she did it. Obina said he and Daniel picked her and her friend in a hotel. And as she is a prostitute. But look at her calmness upon my drama at Daniel's house. She still came here. Or was she here to poison me? This tea now may be poisoned though, due to what I did to her. Some of these girls hooving around hotels and uh, doing prostitution are poisonous. Osibundu, you are a great seer and a herbalist. But you may have failed on this. You may have. No, I will not drink this tea. Bannon, she has to test it. Oh, 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 Ah, well, it's, it's your tea. Please check it with two so I can get cold water to drink. Why don't you try it? Where is your own tea? I don't like drinking tea. Or I'll, I'll eat something else later. Mm. Okay. Try it and see if it is hot. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Is that how to test tea? Mm. Eh? Try it now, and I don't want any pains again. Eh? If it injures my my tongue now, no na yil and na yoka. Runye mm runye. Hmm. Where's the cup? Up. Try it very well. Hmm. Mama, mm? I'll finish it too. So, what are you going to eat? Oh, uh, it's something else later. Yes. Okay. Okay. So, Mama, yeah. drink your tea so I can go and finish up with our story. Okay. But please eat. Oh, Mama. <laughs> eat. What do you go? Hey, she didn't test bread. Oh, eh? Onye mama muli nda buyi. Me drink only tea now. I don't see no boom. The way the way I dealt with her, she can do anything. Ah. So you're not aware? No, I'm not aware. Seriously, I am not. I thought it was somebody they paid to take care of her. I was even thinking they would send for Urema and uh, what's that her name that she usually allowed to fetch water from her borehole? That Chica. Chica. I was thinking they would send for Urema and Chica. Hmm. Those ones. Those ones that lied that they are now in the city. I saw them at the market yesterday selling Santana. I put like what's mm -hmm. I know they will not want to come because they feel they'll be tied down. Are you serious? Eh? I saw them. You saw them at the market? Yes. Hey! Those were the same girls that made that woman to insult my father and he chased a chuku. So they are in this town and they refuse to help that woman. Hmm. You see this life? You see this life? And my father that has a good heart will be telling me, go and help her now. Go and give her food. Go and see her. Of course I refuse. I refuse because it is better for that woman to die of hunger than to die, die of poison. 
Because if I eventually cook hey. for that woman, Amarachi, if I cook for that woman, she will surely die. My because friend. that food must be poisoned. Well, it's a good thing, though, that her children have brought someone from the city to come and take care of her. Because there's no one in this village, even the women, has agreed to come and see her. Is that a good thing? It is not a good thing. It is not a good thing. That woman is so bad. She's so bad. Anyway, thank God that Ikedi's son's borehole will soon be ready. Then we can be fetching water the way we like. Uh -uh. Have they started work again? Ha! Ah, work is in progress. Hey, My father you. even sent me to go and uh, 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 tell them something. My friend, let's go. I want to even see how they're doing that thing. Okay, let's, let's go this go. way. You know you like us. Like you too, you don't like us. You, you guests like you. You don't be fetching water from this place. You won't But because you are so late. No, no, no. You won't jump away. Who is Mother Tatcha? The Almighty Dana's mom. She's inside. Eh? Well, come, let's go and see. Wait, first. What? Obago. This one here, Madam Figan. Obago. Come on, come on. Obago. Good afternoon, Mama. Mm. 
Good afternoon, my dear. How are you? I'm fine. Emma, she's oh. my friend, and a copper too. She just came to see me. Oh. Thank you for visiting us. Oh. Mm -hmm. How is the youth service? Yeah, Mama, we're just managing to finish and be free. Uh -huh. We're getting better. Mm. My dear. I am. All oh, thanks to you, Oma. Please thank her for me. I will. I'm going to take myself. All right. It's all sweet. Okay, Mama. Thank you. <laughs> you don't really enter this woman. Imagine her saying all thanks to Iwama. So your name is Iwama? Well, that's my middle name. Daniel loves the name so much and now his mother has adopted it. <laughs> <laughs> you are now a wife. Oh. So no need of running. Mm -hmm. Please don't say that again. Mm -mm. Wife? No. Mm -mm. So what if um, Danny proposes? He has not. Okay. We're just dating and we're close friends. I don't want anyone to see this as, as a means of me wanting to get married to this family. Mm -mm. No. By the way, I'm just trying to help Daniel. He's been good to me. Yeah, he's been good to me. I just want him to concentrate on his work. And my time here will soon aspire. And I'll be back. <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> okay. No problem now. Because I'm hungry. What did you cook? Oh, food. Now that you wait, hey, get which food for you. Let me eat. Do I look like a cook? You will wait. We'll go to the market Sorry, together. Never, which market? I'm going to the market. You see why I'm calling you his wife? <laughs> so now, 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 get that. You're going to lose half. You're very stupid. Yeah, be sure. Are you? Are you sure? Are you sure you want to eat food? You're very stupid. You're going to get something. Ah, this guy, you sure? Yeah, stupid girl. 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 Mama, you're better now. My dear. Hmm? Yeah, Mama, just try and see if you can walk. Hmm? Mm -hmm. we, have to, we have to test it today. Mama, you can walk. Hey, yes. Mama, don't worry, you can walk. Let's try. Hmm? You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Mama, hmm. Mama, you can do it. Mama, walk for you. That's one by one. Hey, hey! Oh, my God. Mama, even though Zibon you said you can walk. You see? You said so. You can walk. You can walk, Mama. Mama, yes, so. Mama, that is you walking, though. Mama, you can walk. Mama, hey! Yes. <laughs> Mama, you Mama, you're doing it, you see? Mama, Mama yes. yes! Yes, yes, yes. Mama, okay, my. See, see, Mama can walk. Mama can walk. Mama can walk. Mama, don't, don't mama can walk. Mama, you can walk. You can do it. I trust you, Mama. You can do it. My waist. My waist. Just manage. Can walk. Mama, go. Hey. Mama, you can do it. You can do it. You're doing it already. Hmm. Yes. Easy. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Mama. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. Mama, I'm going to leave you here now. No, it's still paining me. Mama. I can't walk here. You can walk, walk, Mama. Believe hey, me. Hey, Mama, no. Please, now. Mama, walk. Please. Mama, walk, Mama. You're doing, doing it already. It. Oh, Mama, it's me. Oh. Mama, <gasps> we trust you. Do hey. it. Hey. Yes, Mama, walk. Hey. Okay, let's sleep. Mm -hmm. Hey, my waist, oh. Oh, walk, Papa, yeah, Mama. 
Mama walk. Mama walk. Just, okay. just try. Oh. Yeah. Mama, that is you walking. Yeah. Mama, you have fun. Mama. Mama, go. Mama, go. You can do it. Mama! Mama, you can go. Mama, you can do it. Oh. Mama! 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 took um two days off if not i would have stayed long it's fine hmm? but um besides that i didn't show up at all he only calls what you want me to do i mean i know he's very busy and probably he'll come soon hmm? mm. yeah but i'm just i'll leave once he once he comes and i'll yeah. tell him that you came around <laughs> okay on the love and you when are you coming back no mm? no your cds and class work they are piling up. I'll come back soon. You have to come back. I will. I will. So when is this soon? Once he comes, I'll leave. Mm. I mean, now his mom is, is getting much better. Mm. Happy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, <laughs> come and go. Bye. See you over, baby. Bye. Bye. I'll see you. Take care of yourself. Bye. You are my mom. No. Thank you for everything. Thank you so much for taking care of me. You took care of me like I am your mother. Thank you. I'm sorry for what I did to you in the past. You know that day at Daniel's house, I acted based on what Obina told me about you. I molested you like you're not human, like you're not someone else's child. I am sorry. These few weeks, I have been monitoring you, watching everything about you, and I am confused. I'm confused about all the things they told me. I don't think it's true. Is it? Emma. Emma, it's okay. I mean, I, I see it as my duty to take care of you as my friend's mother. Yeah. Danny has been really, really kind to me. And it's natural for me to just return his kindness. Can't you walk in? It will go anyway. Did they meet you at the hotel like they told me? Were you at the brothel? Amma, the story is too long. But certainly not how Obin has to say it. Daniel will explain better to you. I am so sure about it. Mama, my life has not been easy. I, I made a lot of mistakes. And Obina is using it to judge me. It's okay. It's okay, Mom. Oh, we've all made mistakes. And once we realize, we move on. We just pick our pieces and move on. I believe you've moved on. So if you and Daniel are compatible, no problem. I will not stop you. Mama, 
Mama. I don't know. I don't see people coming here to even check up on you. At least I don't see your fellow women and men coming to see what has happened to you. Mm. <laughs> that is one of my mistakes. It was. I chased all of them out. I seized them from having access to the borehole my husband ducked for them. Why? I mean, that would make them see you as a wicked woman. I know. This is a long story, but I will cut it. They don't like me. And I hated them too. When I was married into this community, into this village newly, there was this tradition and custom which they refused to perform for me. It's a little ritual, but very important. You know, as a young girl, who is naive, a virgin, chastity shows on you. They will buy you gifts, biscuits, perfume, handkerchief, slippers, underwears. Now, they will call a dancing group. Gather the young girls of your age, or above, or beyond. Dance with the gifts to your father's house to show your chastity, and it makes you proud. They refuse to do it for me. And I was very, very furious about it. I don't know how to explain this. This made me less important to me so when my husband died I seized the opportunity to stop them access to the borehole I chased all of them out because I was believing they don't want me so why using my water The grudge has been there for so long without me realizing that I was making a mistake. Because I extended this grudge to children that was not born before I came to this community. It wasn't easy. Mm -hmm. Somebody just, just forgive. Okay. Yeah, I have personally I have learned to just forgive people that did me wrong. Open the gates. Allow the flow of peace to reign. That's how I see life. That's well, my dear. Thank you. Thank you for making me know you. Thank you for taking care of me. My God, the one I serve, Eloy, will bless you. Amen. Thank you. <laughs> Help? Yes. Okay, uh, I'm here to see your father. Please, can you go in and call him? Okay. Papa! Papa! Mama, what is it? Please come.
Good morning, sir. Good morning, my daughter. How are you? I'm fine. I'm from Mama Injendu's house. Um, I'm the girl looking after her since she was poisoned. I don't see Kingsman coming to ask after her. No, her co women. So that was when she said that she literally stopped everybody from using the ball hole. And she gave her reasons. So she would like to see you and your daughter. And I'll be so glad if you can just come and see her, please. Never. That will be over my dead body. How would you say that? You don't have to say that. You'd have to wait to hear from her first. I don't care. I don't care what she has to say. Grandma. Papa. It's okay. Uh, my daughter. Yes, sir. Don't worry. We shall be there. Hmm? Go and tell her that we shall be there. Hmm? We'll come. Okay. Mm -hmm. Go down. We'll go and see Jenda. We'll go and see her. Hmm. Do not bother. We'll see her. Hmm? Papa, I'm not going no. You will go with me. Sit down. Do what you're doing. Um, Ibekwe, my brother, don't worry. Go and see her since she is the one that sent for you. But in case she says anything concerning us, please do tell us. Eh? It may just be the normal family issues. I will see her tomorrow. But it must be when I am through with the things I have with Igwe. Ah. You remember the electric uh, cable uh, issue at the pallets? Oh, oh, oh. You people have not concluded about that. <laughs> My dear, the town union did not submit the account. They have not tendered the account. And we are having crucial meeting tomorrow morning towards it. Ah. Yes. Okay. Um, when you go tomorrow, please go well. Huh? It's all right. Let me run along. It's all right. Let me be going to. Okay. I'll take care. And you still nurture crutches to this age. Agenda, why? Why? Uguma and other children in this clan, we are not yet born when you got married into this family. And you have forgotten that, my brother. Your late husband, single handedly, bought everything and we took all of them to your father's house and not the other way it's been done those things killed my spirit and i vowed never to do anything with your clan's people even your children i was just enduring it when my husband was alive I'm sorry, I, I have offended you so dearly. So, so dearly. I'm sorry. Ogoma. Nem. Find a way to forgive me. Oh, Nem. Please. Ugo. Come and sit. Inugo, Biko, please come and sit with me. He be where you're near, oh, Biko. Go on. Go I know I offended you so badly. From your heart of hearts, forgive me, Pico. Ichindo broke one match of Madu. Broke one match of Madu. 
Oh, we want the Kleido. Please forgive me. Nico. It's okay. I am not a bad person. Please forgive me. See, you can fetch water. Hmm? Tell your sisters. Tell your friends. Eh? Tell your clan girls that the borehole is theirs. They can fetch us so many gallons as they want. Nico, um, I am coming. Papa, this is your said that we can come and fetch water. As many as you want. We can be coming here to fetch water. And she has repented. <sighs> Please. Nem, please. Accept it. Oh, buy as many gallons as you can. I know I broke your gallon. I am sorry. Take the balance to buy clothes. Change your hairstyle. I don't want your hair to be like this again. Oh, if you need anything, just let me know. Okay, if I don't have enough money, I will call my children to bring it. Okay, ma. You are my daughter. You should be the daughter I never had. Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. Oh, thank you. Please. I will tell. No, you don't put money there. Mm, okay. Mm, it's cancerous. Also, my father. So, no, it will not. Okay. It will not. Okay. Ibekwe. Mm. Please don't collect this money from her. Oh, my dear, from your school fees and everything, I'll take care of it. Oh, I am still collecting my pension as a retired teacher. I retired as a school principal. So, Ibekwe, leave her worries. Her expenditures to me. I will even tell Obina, my son, to buy horse that can get from here to the village square. You will be in charge until you go to the university. Mm -hmm. Anybody that needs water, they don't need to come here. They will just fetch. Oh, Ibekwe. I know I degraded your title. I remembered I removed your cap and marched on it. I don't know how to atone for my sins. Please, tell Ichi Ezechuku that I also want to see him. I know I offended him. Because... Oh, we want the Kledo. Okay. It's okay. We are not having anything against you. And it's alright. You continue to be our wife. We will continue to love you. We, we will be the same thing. One family. Do not cry. We can understand. Please, don't cry. It's okay. Do not cry, please. We can understand. It's okay, It's Ma. okay. Don't stop crying. Why don't you make me? But it's cold. Mama, 
My brother, don't judge someone by his look. Now situation, make the fish burn. Your choice is not my choice. If I have a so so, never go. My hidden treasure looking for I've been looking for My hidden treasure She's the hidden treasure I've been looking for She's mine forever My hidden treasure Trust everything you see, even the salt looks like sugar. Be careful who you trust. My catching in a bureau food, but follow your heart. So the world begin. You can never be misled by your heart. Only your heart will tell you the truth. You have seen she's a white material. She's an angel, beautiful heart. She's white material. So, Mama, so you allowed that girl in this house? You mean Iwoma? <laughs> My Iwoma. She's the best. She has turned my life around. She's told me everything about herself. That girl is 100% better than your wife. Mm hmm. Has your wife ever swept this compound since she was married into this family? Has she ever washed my clothes nor cooked food for me? I knew that you quarreled with her because she refused to come and take care of me when I was seriously down. But Ihoma did. With with all her heart. She was just trying to help a dying grandmother and frustration took her to where you and Danny met her. Because she's the nicest soul ever. Like the saying goes, we shouldn't judge a book by its cover. Hmm? Are you serious about this? I wouldn't pretend for anything. This girl has brought peace to my soul in my life. She's brought peace between your uncle and all the elders of this clown that I have offended. And I know that the news must have spread. Your wife couldn't do it. She's the nicest thing, the nicest person I have ever seen. A wife material. Everything you will need in a woman dwells in her. Well groomed with a beautiful heart. Only your heart we tell you the truth. My evil man. You have seen she's a wife material. She's an angel. Oh. How are you? Well, I'm fine. And I hope you're going to just slap me again because I'm already going to find my back. Slap slap you? Why? 
The last time you slapped me. I've had bad blood in years. That's not true. Sorry from the depths of my heart. I, I was seeing a cockroach I met in the club. But my younger brother saw something else. Mama told me everything. She told me everything you did for her. I want to especially appreciate you for taking time to take good care of my mother. And also uniting her with a clansman. That was commendable. I, as a matter of. As a matter of fact, I will take you to the best hospital for ear treatment. Yes, I will. And I'll personally reward you adequately for everything you did for my mother. Thank you. You know, there is something I saw in her that you didn't see. Sometimes life pushes us to the dark side. And it takes only a seer like me to see the light in one's forehead, even when the person is in the dark. I saw gold in her. She's a wife material, despite where we picked her from. I believe in now, you know. Mama is fine. And I'm glad. And um, I'm missed classes, so I have to go. Thank you very much. Is she really seven? Because I thought it was all cooked up lies to market her acceptability. <laughs> Ubina. Never judge a book by its cover. She is truly sorry. Yes. I know why you were reacting like that. Because of where we met her and where we picked her from. Yes, but trust me, she, she was just pushed into that by her life pressure. She's not that kind of person, trust me. Took that word from me. Don't judge her by the cop. I judge her by her cop. So, I. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. You don't do no to tap currents. Oh, oh, no, oh, Danny. Oh, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> so, thanks for all you do. Huh? So, thank you. So, Valerie. Mm -hmm. So good. She's wife material. I'm a judge with what you see. She's an angel with what you see. Beautiful eyes. She's wife material. Is this not what we had wanted? We are not bad people. The truth is, agents who never gave us, no, our wives, the chance to explain how and what happened during that time. Um, we also have to consult the women or else this whole thing will still linger. Oh, your wife did not tell you. Tell me what? Jenna was in their meeting last night huh? and she presented them with gifts as they promised them that their next meeting will be in her own house. Hey, sure. Eh? Yes. Ah! <laughs> okay. What are we saying? You are, you, you are not aware. That means you have settled in peace. You know, good resolution brings peaceful mind. <laughs> Listen, honestly, she has tried. If you ask me, she has tried. Let's just, let's just give her a chance. Let's, let's forgive and forget. Let's push this thing aside. Huh? Especially you, Eze. I know how you used to get angry. <laughs> I'm the happiest person in this community now. 
I will go to her and then we'll discuss more concerning the future. <laughs> the company is there. And um, not even one of our graduates is employed because they're following her instructions. So I'll go and uh, let us talk about it. Yeah, I think uh, these ones, uh, we can get to them gradually. gradually. If you ask me, gradually. Uh, it is still the gradual process. Finally. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> you are my... How can you be saying this when you have stolen my heart? When I have come to love you so deeply. And I explained to you that I need a daughter-in-law who will love me the way you do. You can't do this to me now. You can't do this to me and my family. Who are you leaving me for? Who? Oh, you can't joke on me alone. Precious. I thought you'd forgiven me. What do you want my brother to do? After everything is done because of you, the time you invested, the resources, his emotions. Come on, look at my mother. She's gotten used to you. And as you can see, she's feeling bad already. Please, don't do this to us. Mama, Mama is my mother too. What you're asking me to do is not going to feed all this family. But I mean, Danny, we never discussed marriage. But I'm ready to marry you. Yes. We never discussed marriage because the opportunity never presented itself. Precious, I'm ready to marry you today, now, tomorrow. Just say it. You don't understand. Daddy, I mean, let's just be best friends. I can be visiting Mama anytime. And I will visit you as, 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 as long as you want this friendship to last. But Danny, please, go put us together so we can help each other. And, and please, just skip this marriage and focus on the friendship. Please. Precious. You can't be saying this now that I have fallen in love with you. No. You can't, you can't, you can't, you can't disappoint me in the presence of my mom and brother. Listen, I have fallen in love with you. I can't live without you. Please, don't do this. I don't understand. And make me understand. Danny, I have no womb. I have no womb. And you want children, Mama? He would, he would certainly need a male child. To see how what? How can you say this with your mouth? Shut up! Mama, that's the truth, Mama. You can't be saying this with your mouth. Shut your mouth up! But that's the truth. I have no womb, but I can't. I can't have kids. What happened to your womb? What happened to your womb? The first time I I slept with a man. It was when I lost my home. It was when Amanuko's sickness started. New and the drug was really expensive. And in the bit to cover up and not to disappoint my grandmother. The woman that was there for me when I lost my mother. 
in the labor room. And so I took concussions and I lost my womb. <laughs> and he landed me in local chemist. That was when I sought for professional doctors and they told me that that I had lost my womb. So Lenny, I'm sorry. <laughs> And I'm sorry. I can't have kids. I'm so sorry. Please. Listen, listen. You made an expensive mistake. <laughs> but you're going nowhere. I've fallen in love with you. <laughs> For that reason, I am ready to spend any amount. I will fly you to the best hospital abroad. Let's see if they can restore your womb. I'm ready to do whatever it takes to make sure your womb is fixed. Please don't do this to me. Why until then? For telling him, sorry, I have to go. Can you please? Can you? And you're a good man. You're too good. And I love you so much. <laughs> and I'm sorry. <laughs> and thank you so much for, for helping a poor girl like me that was in need. God will bless you. God will bless you for everything you've done for me. Thank you. <laughs> I have to go. <laughs> You're going nowhere. Yes. We're in this together. You're going nowhere. I have been sorrowful. I have been good. Things are like me. Nobody. 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 Thank you. 